Is it? <laughs> oh my goodness. I think that would be a striking piece of fabric with the green yes. in the background mm. and the red. Absolutely, maybe something for you to think yeah, about. Yeah, it may go. It may go into something else. We don't know yet. Yes. So, um, yeah, all of my ranges have ended up with birds in them and very strong yes. colours, and also quite a quite a definite theme yes. in, yeah. in all of them. Um, we've got a dress just at the side of Sarah. Don't worry, I won't be putting it on, um, but I would because it is a beautiful, beautiful design dress. You made this, this didn't no, you? No, 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 I didn't. No, Did you no know these have been made for, some of these samples have oh, been made wow. for me from the Craft Cotton Company bloggers. So this has been made by Stephanie Marsh. Oh, Stephanie, that is beautiful. Isn't that absolutely gorgeous? Yeah, it really is. What a look, you know, if you had like a little cardigan to go with that, you know, yes. if you're a summer party, mm. what, how much fabric would you say has been used in that project? I think probably a metre and a half, yeah. maybe two. Okay. So, you know, if you are going to make dresses, you probably do want to buy yeah. a couple of metres. It does depend on the sizing, yeah. obviously, because that, course, does, yeah. that does make a difference. Steam, and though, isn't it? It's beautiful, isn't it? And I've seen um, there's a lady called Laura as well on uh, Instagram who'd made a dress with uh, this one. So because Ooh, because they do send fabric be out to the bloggers yeah. and they, they do have a if you are watching you've got any pictures of that dress please do send it in we would love to see that it's not just um, home furnishing no 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 of we've course. got we've got we've all got sorts. other projects that you can create. Oh. yes so oh, these they have little skirts on. Yeah. well they're French knickers <laughs> oh hello <laughs> yeah. oh autumn down sorry oh, dear oh dear dear oh dear hang on let me put them back up I didn't mean to do I really did not mean to do that. So this is, but these have been made by Sarah. This is SJ Stitching, XJ Stitchery, S, oh dear, oh dear, SJ <laughs> Stitchery. Seven, seven, four. Yes, exactly. But look, she's made little lily pads oh, for them that... to sit on. Oh, and I saw gorgeous. them and I was like, can you please send them in for me? Because I need them on my show. Again, perfect fabric for it with the water. Yeah, but yeah. you wouldn't even think, I wouldn't have thought. This is so imaginative and yeah. so and fun yes. as well. Yeah, these with are little, beautiful. With little beanies in them. These little, are brilliant. It's I very love that. absolutely oh, very the joints at the arms as well. They're gorgeous. Uh, now, of course, they're beautiful, but you can use your fabric um, yes. on your storage. At home. So these have been made for me by my friend Deborah, Deborah Moore, who, if you follow me at all and you see my travels, it's Deborah who's usually my partner in crime. Um, we're getting into trouble somewhere. Um, she has made these for me. Now these are from um, MDF units from the Tonic range yes. that um, we had uh, not so long ago. I saw them and went, I need these. Yeah. And she has covered them with my fabric so onto card construction card with book binding glue yeah and i've told her she's not having them back <laughs> so they're going in my bedroom so they are this lovely aren't they? absolutely beautiful and then you've got the big one next to you yes. there which has got the little drawers in there you go but you can, this is how you can use up your scraps because she's mixed and matched those drawers she's fussy cut onto the sides where you've got those gorgeous um big birds on the side here the big kingfishers and then the individual drawers yeah absolutely stunning isn't it lovely is everybody's so clever it's such a clever idea it really is and it is such a fantastic range as well right let's bring the details up for the fat quarters they are extremely busy that's the official one day special but we also have some one day special x I will call them alongside that so 25 pounds and 98 pence you've seen the whole range you've seen how beautiful the fabrics are and how they work wonderfully for your individual projects or bringing them together you're getting all 10 fat quarters 829947 is your item number just I mean just look at the colors they're gorgeous now 60% of the one day special has gone and as far as we are aware there are no more uh, okay, so we have some half meters for you if you want to go for the larger fabric. Remember, you can cut these down into your fat quarters if you want to. Seventy pounds and ninety-nine pence, but seventy percent of the stock of this particular bundle has gone. Nine double six eight zero three is your item number. You get ten half meters in that particular bundle, and they're all wrapped beautifully with that ribbon as well. Then we've got the meters. We've got two options for you. We've got the whites range, so you've got your kingfisher in there, you've got your daisies, you've got your water lilies, your butterflies on the water lilies, and you've got that green bubble water. £63.89, pence. you can of course divide the cost of that. And remember this is designer fabric. There's the blue, 584829 is your item number.
Uh, and again, you can divide the cost, so it's a great way of buying from us here at Create and Craft. Uh, lovely to have you company this evening. So very proud of Sarah, and we're so happy that Sarah has brought this particular collection to us as well. We have the 10 inch squares, they're just hanging on by a thread. They keep technically selling out, they're one or two a bounce back. So do check out your baskets. And when you check out your baskets, you'll be entered into the draw, of course, to win £2,000 worth, or not over, of sewing goodies. 774744. Please check out your baskets, and I won't need to read that item <laughs> number again. <laughs> Uh, right, your 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 pattern booklet. Um, wow, that's been really busy. Twelve ninety nine. If you are in the club, uh, two payments of five pounds and eighty five pence, which is a superb deal. And stock wise, seventy five percent of the stock has gone of that. Uh, so, whew, don't know what we're going to do later, but something will be done. <laughs> uh, right, Sarah. <laughs> and my weekend may have just freed up. Who knows? <laughs> uh, we've got about twenty minutes left of this hour but Sarah's with us for the next hour I am as well. yes, yes yes a, dub, a double whammy yeah, you. yeah. Uh, and me as well sadly sorry but I'm <laughs> sorry not sorry yeah <laughs> sorry not sorry because I love working with you okay Sarah what are we going to look at right now we didn't get a chance to look at it but there's a quilt that was hanging behind us that has been made Ooh, again yes this is one of the bloggers from Quilters United UK yes. Um, and uh, if you go to their blog, you'll see the free pattern. Ooh, but look that's... at that. That was made by Car Carol Lightburn, so he's kindly sent it to me because I saw it um, on Instagram, and I was like, please send it to me. Do you know what? The square with all the butterflies, it looks like yes. they're flying out. It does, doesn't that's it? That's very clever. That's bl that block's actually called a churn dash. Oh. So that's the, the block, and that's what I'm going to show you how to do. Oh, excellent. So if we've got time. Yes. So um, basically, it's a form of nine patch with two uh, sets of half square triangles. Okay. So that's what we're going to do. I'm going to show you very quickly yep. how you can construct that part of it. Because I just saw it, and I said, oh, please, can I have it? She said, it's not finished. I said, oh. it doesn't matter. I want it. So thank you so much for sending it. And thank you, everybody, who's sent in um, the samples for me. Um, I really do appreciate yeah. it because it's one thing to, you know, you, you you design the fabric and everything, but then you kind of let it out into the yeah. world. Are you nervous when uh, that happens? Yes, terrified. And the fact that this is my fourth go, you think I'd be used to it by now. I'm really not. I'm really not because oh. you send it out and you're like, oh, I really hope people like it. I really hope. Well, they do. They are, obviously. So, um, and I've, I mean, Carly and the others are in the green room going, just relax, will you, please? <laughs> I, did, I, will, I, will I did notice tense. you're kind of walking up the corridor quite a lot today. <laughs> in the kitchen, out the kitchen, down the corridor. Up. I thought, oh, Sarah must be busy. But it was Sarah nerves. was just a little agitated oh, today. But well, well you know, done you. It's because it's because we put so much effort into yeah, into these things, and you know, you you kind of let it out into the world, and then when people actually make things with it, and they look at what they've made with pride, yes. you know, there's no there's no better feeling than that yeah, really. Sure. So um, yes, but it it takes a long time. From I mean. It was last August, probably, I did the paintings. It? So it's nearly a year. Wow, well, that is, yeah. So, you know, it's kind of... Yes. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to cut... I've got four layers here. I've got two of the white, yep. and I've got two of the blue uh, with the dragonflies. Okay. And I'm going to cut some six-inch squares. Now, I know that these, this side and this side are not straight. Okay. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to move in a little bit. And then I'll chop it down. Okay, so you can see here I'm almost at seven. So, but that's okay. So I'm going to nice sharp blade, whiz up like that. You see, make sure you've cut and cut across the top. Okay. All right. Then I'm going to rotate them because now I know that these two corners are nice and okay, nice and neat. And I'm going to do six and a half inches. Okay. All right. As I said, the pattern, the full pattern, I'm just doing my own sizes here, just showing you what we can, there we go. So now what we're going to do is we're going to take these two pieces and I'm going to put the fabrics right sides together, which means the pattern printed sides together. Yes. Like that. So the first thing we're doing is making half square triangles. Now, um, if you are making multiples, 
um, of half square triangles. In the next show, we have my guide to angles book that shows you how to do multiple lay multiples uh, of them. You but. could <laughs> get that now if you head to the website, and you can get it in the same basket if you wish. Right, so I'm getting. I'm going to use a sharpie for this. We okay. do not use a sharpie in real life. No. But it just means if I use a pencil or a chalk, you probably won't be able to see it. Okay. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to draw a diagonal line across the bottom of the back okay. like this. I put my two fabrics right sides together. Oh. There we go. So don't up. use a sharpie at don't home. Don't use a sharpie at home. Use but a, this an is erasable pen or, or <laughs> tennis chalk. Yes. Look at that. It's a great big stonking line, but it means you can see it. Yes. Yes, because you can you can actually crease it if you want to, but then you can't see that on TV. So do you do you say that in your book? Draw a great big, big stonking, stonking line. line. <laughs> no, but I should. I think you should. <laughs> when I first started writing patterns for magazines, yeah. I used to put things, little jokes in it, and they used to take them out. <laughs> <laughs> now oh. I leave, now I do my own. I just leave them in. Oh. So maybe next time I will put a stonking line yes. in there just for you, Janice. Yes, thank you. Right. So the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to set my um, my needle at a quarter of an inch. So okay. I've got a quarter of an inch seam allowance. And I'm going to watch this because yes. I have this machine. This is what uh, started my sewing journey on. You have indeed. Well, this particular machine has a quarter of an inch stitch on it. Okay. Stitch number 46. Yes. Which, um, if you look at your... I'll just turn this. We do have these available, by the way, on the website if you want to go for the Brother sewing machine. It is the FS180QC. So there you can see there's stitch number 46. Or oh, maybe turn it around a little bit more. Yep. There you go. It's got a little P underneath it for patchwork. Yep. If you've got your J foot on there, that'll give you a quarter of an inch seam allowance. Oh, okay. So, now technically, what we're doing with a half square triangle is we're supposed to cut it. You know when we make half squares bigger, we add a seam allowance yes. of half an inch. Well, when you're doing half square triangles, you're supposed to do seven eighths of an inch. Yes. So, slightly more. But, to be honest, seven eighths of an inch, an inch. I do an inch and trim down because seven eighths of an inch is one of these little lines on here and quite frankly life's too short to worry about that. Yeah. So round up, trim down. What's the seventh of an inch between friends? Exactly. Exactly. So I'm going to move to that stitch. So stitch number 47. There we go. With my J foot. And that will, it wasn't 47, it was 46. There we go. I just looked at that and thought, that's not a quarter of an inch. <laughs> so then I'm going to grab my, oh, just got myself tangled. Hold on. So is the foot that you're using there the regular foot that you get yes. with your brother? It is indeed. And then we're going to sew down. But basically what we're doing is we're using our stonking great big line yes. as the edge of our foot. Okay. All right. Ah. So we're sewing slightly in. Big stonker on the edge of the foot. Exactly. Got you. So there we go. Flip it round and sew up the other, up the other side of the line. So is that how you, is that created a seam line? Yes. So that's so, how you. So this that's is how, how you, do, you do it. Yeah, if you haven't got a ruler yeah. that lets you do, um, if you haven't got a ruler that lets like this, like this one, that will let yep. you cut half square triangles. If you, you haven't got one of those, yep. you can um, use this method. This method, yes. Perfect. So I'm just trying to grab my. There we go. So you see now what we do is we chop along that stonking great line, oh. and then when we open it up. Magic! <gasps> you see, and why do I do it like Magic. that? Magic! So I'm just going to do the other one, and that gives us the four that we need now for that block. I do. Now I, was do I was doing it by eye just to have a go, but now I know that technique. Yes. Brilliant. This, because you can do a great big pile of these. Yeah. And I will do it. It's called chain piecing, mm -hmm. where you go from one to the next to the next to the next. You yeah. have them all prepped, and then you cut all of them, and then you press all of them. So let's come back to the other side. Right, but whilst you're doing that, we've had a question from Julie Hallam from Leicester. Oh, hello. Julie who, sorry? Julie Hallam from Leicester. Hello, Julie. I'm from Leicester. That's the, When you're from Leicester, you say Leicester. 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 Yes. L-E-S-T-A. Leicester. I'm from um, Rutland. They took us over for a bit. But uh, we, we did, but then you yeah. got it back. But, you know, we might come in again and get it. Our council tax went up, so please do. <laughs> So we found a king in the car park. I'm sure we'll be yeah, able to exactly. come and take it over again. <laughs> uh, right, hi Janice, Sarah and all the crew, says Julie. Hello Julie. Oh, hello Julie. These fabrics are stunning. Love the Kingfisher so I have purchased the Fat Quarter Bundle. I want to get back into sewing. I yes. have never made a quilt, so has Sarah got any top tips, please? And that's from Julie. Okay. Um, uh, 
Plenty. Okay. So first of all, accuracy in seam allowances. Yes. Okay, so you can either use a foot or have a stitch like this because if you can cut accurately, which is the first step, you can sew accurately and then your results will be accurate as well. Yep. I would definitely invest in a rotary cutter, a ruler and a mat because quite frankly to cut squares with scissors, life is too short. Yes. And then press everything like I am now yes. uh, because that will just make everything go together so, so much better. Totally um, yeah, so that's, that's a, a start. Yes. <laughs> And then, uh, and then, you know, get one of my books. Exactly. That I mean, was just Sarah, what I was going to say. Sarah Payne's Quilt School. I think we've still got it in stock. Yeah. That's designed to take you from the very basic principles yep. from sewing squares together into a bag Ooh. to actually working with curves and all sorts all the way through. I need to get myself that book. If we've got it on the show uh, or on the website, you'll be able to find it. But we do have other books. These are all the patterns we do have on the show. Great prices for you as well and all divisible into your flexi payment so it makes it affordable. And the brand new one we've got today is a slice of cake pattern. And I like the way we've got those lovely pictures of Sarah on there as well. <laughs> I'd cut that out and I'd put that in my wallet. I would. I would. Because it's, it's a nice, it's a nice picture. It was basically, it was, I, I needed a picture. And you know where you just go, <sighs> Well, listen, if, if, if that's how you take that picture, you must take some stunning pictures then because it's a brilliant photo. Thank you. you. Thank you. Yes, we've used it. Somebody posted in one of the groups today as well a picture and her fabric had arrived and my pattern. But the way she bought some fabric, the way it was all, it looked like somebody just stuck a picture of me onto the front of something weird. It was like, what? What? It, oh, it's my pattern. It just looked really odd. It was, all, it was the way it was all kind of... <laughs> Fabulous. Uh, thank you for your email, Julie. If anyone else wants to email in, it is studio at creatingcraft.com. Please do. Yes, I'm just checking Now, these to see. work lovely together. So you've got the deep blues and then you've gone for a really nice... Yes, I've got a scroll white. here. So this is, we call it a white on white or a tone on tone. Yes. Um, which means basically it's got a white pattern in it rather than just being plain white. And I just realised that the piece I've got is not big enough. Okay. This is not big enough. So, um, what would you like on. to do? I'm going to change my fabric. Hang on, I'll go for this one. Okay. Let's use this instead. I've got a stock update for you. In the meantime, the fat quarters. 75% of the stock of your fat quarters. That's your one day special. You're getting all 10 of those. 829947 is your item number for those. What was the stock update? I've just said it and I forgot. 75% of the stock again. My goodness. 75% of the stock has gone. Wow. Oh my goodness. It's supposed to last four shows. Yeah, it is. Mm. It is, but it's not going to happen. It's not going to happen. I just wonder what they're um, going to make me to do tomorrow. <laughs> Also, the half meters are going to sell out any moment because we're very busy for those and we're still hanging on for the 10 inches. We've got single figures for those. Okay. Busy, busy show. Yes. Thank you very much, everybody. Oh. Right. I'm going to trim these to six inches, but I need to do six and a half inches. So Why? Because I need to make, if we can have a look at that quilt on the wall again, can yes. we have a quick look at that, that block? So we're doing the one in the top left. All right, so we have there four uh, half square triangles, yep. and then we basically got a strip. Oh, um, yeah. It, 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 yes, I'm completely getting my maths yeah. wrong. Only three and a half inches, not six and a half. Got so, you. yes, let's do that. Um, we've only got about three and a half minutes left of the show. I was just, I was just uh, five minutes of the show. Oh, got even more. Uh, but we've only got about three minutes left to demo because we're going to take okay. two minutes saying goodbye. Only we have to say well, hello again over the other side of the studio. <laughs> yes, that's you and me. So now what we're doing is I'm taking two strips, three and a half inches wide. These and are so sewing. On. Thank you. <laughs> wow. Are you going to do a Yanis where he goes, you're quite good at this? Do you but know yeah, what? It's Sarah? actually my job. I don't, I don't know if anyone's told you this, but you're pretty good at this. <laughs> Well, they keep asking me back, so I must be doing something right. 
But you see, the next stage of this particular fabric's journey has nothing to do with me anymore. Yeah. You know, I made a thing, we pass it out into the world, and then other people take it on their journey. They make it, they look yeah. at it, they love it. They make it into something which they then give to the people that oh, they love. Isn't that nice? And then those people, and honestly, that's the way I look at my fabric. It's starting, I start the journey with yes. it. Yeah. Um, and then it goes off and it, it becomes, it has its own its own life. I've got a question. Okay. What is the width of the stitch that you've used and is it important to get that right? Not particularly. I tend, this particular one is um, two millimetres. Okay. Um, but it's just the standard one that comes on the machine. Is it? Yeah. So okay. sometimes it's two, sometimes it's 2.2, sometimes yeah. 2.5, depending okay. on the stitch. Very neat but stitch. It is a very neat stitch. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to trim with the square. I didn't know you cut. There you go. Okay. So again, uh, these are going to be trimmed to six inches. Okay. So uh, no, six and a half. Hang on, six and a quarter. I can't remember. I think you. Yeah, six. Yeah, I six. will trim them to six. So what we do then, because I'm obviously not going to get time to do the whole block. No, but we're back, uh, or you're back with Yanis at nine o'clock, not Janice, Yanis. So and trick cut bigger and trim down. You'll just find it easier. So this is going to be, I'm going to do this at six inches. So I'm using the three inch line there, trim okay. off a bit there. Just chop the bird's head off, that was a bit unfortunate. But also, I mean, we end up having conversations about how big the bird should be. Okay. Because, you know, you need to think about what scale it's going to be, how, what pe how people are going to cut it. Yes. You know, and and it's quite, you end up with these quite in-depth conversations yes. about, you know, and direction of fabric. Is, there, is the bird going to go the same way up all the way across the oh, fabric or are you going to rotate it? What do you do in the spaces in between? Because, I mean, we're taking this bit of the bird off here, yes. but, you know, that still needs to be interesting yes. even there's no bird yeah. in it. So these are all conversations that you have have. Fascinating. Um, Fascinating. Um, only a minute and a half left of this show. Sarah will be back at nine o'clock continuing this demonstration, but we have had an incredibly busy show and I'm so happy for Sarah because I know how hard you work and I know how um, anxious sometimes you get with your collections, but you shouldn't be because they are absolutely beautiful. They Thank really you. are. And the artwork that you've shown us as well, I mean, that's amazing in itself, but to turn it into fabric and to turn that into something that people are going to get home and absolutely adore and keep in their families for years and years and they'll become heirlooms. heirlooms. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, it's just absolutely fantastic. All you need to do is decide which you're going to go for, uh, which sets you're going to go for and what you're going to do with it when you get it home. Now we have sold out of the 10 inches, that's gone. So we have sold out. We're almost limited stock on the half meters. Wow. <laughs> um, and the one meters, um, and they're absolutely flying out the doors, both color options. And 75% of the fat quarters has gone. That's a one day special. And the pattern book is limited. Wow. Well, I can I can say it's been a success. I think they liked it, don't I, you? I, I, I think they did. Thank you so much. No, Thank you. congratulations, Sarah. It is a wonderful collection. You will still get a chance to buy after the hour. And, of course, Sarah will be back at 9 o'clock, but also in the next few moments. So we've got a good show lined up there, haven't we? We have indeed. We certainly have. Right, go and grab yourself a cup of tea. Do check out your baskets and don't miss out on this wonderful collection. And we'll see you guys in a few moments' time. See you in a minute. Quilting Essentials is coming up next with Sarah. Uh, discover stamps by me, favourites after that, and we've also got Craft Extra. Hi, I'm Abs from Orange Create. I've been crafting for over 10 years now and I love stamping, stenciling, creating layers of colours, textures and creating depth and dimension. Orland Create was established in October 2016, collaborating with a group of designers and artists from all over the world, bringing different designs and products in different styles. We proud ourselves of high quality photopolymer clear stamp sets, dyes, stencils, washi tapes and acrylic blocks, all in different sizes and formats. I hope to bring you inspiration and different ways of using your craft products. Make sure you don't miss the Orland Create shows.
Pixie Buy. It's as simple as shop, click and craft. Buy it today. Spread your payment at no extra cost. There are no fees, no interest and no waiting. So whether you're potty on paper craft, mad on mixed media or just starting your sewing journey, shopping has never been easier. It's time to buy what you want, when you want. With two, three or even four interest-free Flexi Buys. Shop today with Flexi Buy on Create and Craft. Hi, I'm Leslie from Chocolate Baroque and we design and manufacture our own rubber stamps right here in the northeast of England. We have a wonderful in-house designer called Sue who hand draws all the images which we then transfer into rubber stamps. We have very, very elaborate designs. We have everything from steampunk right through to beautiful florals and then we have scenic and we have words. Our stamps are beautifully elaborate, very, very detailed, exquisitely etched, and the quality is next to none. So good that if you look after your stamps, we guarantee them for a lifetime. Whether it's stamping, mixed media, or art journaling, join us for our journey into everything creative and messy and see what you can create with our stamps. everyone yes we are in the midst of our summer festival of quilting what a lovely piece of music to blend us into the show now what's this all about you say well when you buy something in any of our sewing shows you will be put into the draw to win over two thousand pounds worth of sewing goodies including this beautiful singer machine oh my days look at everything that you're getting here and we have more prizes being added in our sewing shows all the way through and the prize that's been added for this hour with the lovely Sarah Payne is just over there she says wrecking the shot don't worry um, just down the bottom there that's all been added to our ever growing prize fund and it will be worth over two thousand pounds I'm just sad that I can't enter but you guys can and all you have to do is buy something during the live hours of which we have right now with the lovely Sarah Payne. Now, there are lots of quilting essentials on the show from So Easy. We've got books for you. We've got marathon threads. Head to the website. That's where you can go to so you can see all the items we've got available for you. We've got some cape facet books for you. We've got some wadding. Um, we've got all kinds of different sewing paraphernalia for you to go and choose from. So it's a great opportunity at great prices to stock up for your craft room. Any questions, of course, about anything we've got on the show that you're seeing live or maybe on the website, please email in to myself and Sarah Page and it's studio at createandcraft.com so we'd love to hear from you. Right, fresh from her very, very, very successful one day special, we've got the lovely Sarah Page. How are you? I'm good. Oh, you're working hard today. <laughs> oh, yes, yes, definitely. But, um, Hey, you know what they say, if you love your job, you never work a day in your life. Exactly, and I know how much you love sewing. You can see it <laughs> right here uh, in the plethora of books that we've got available. I know, I know. Uh, right, where shall we start, okay. I guess, with the first one here, Shapes and Angles? Now, this one, we I've, I've recently brought these to Create and Craft. These are guides and patterns that I have written and, and, and print, and... Um, this was the first one that sold out on okay. that first day. So uh, this is a back in stock. I got okay. some more printed um, because obviously I didn't know how well they were going to go. Yeah. <laughs> and they sort of sold out very quickly. So this is a guide. So this is a guide to shapes and angles, which means you're dealing with 60 degree diamonds. Yes. Uh, you're dealing with Y shaped seams. You're de how to do half square triangles like we've just been talking yes. about and how to do multiples as ah. well. So, you know, what if you need to make eight? 
half square triangles. Yes. There is a method of doing eight all in oh, one go. I thought you were asking me then. No, no, I, no, no, suddenly no, I panicked. No, I, I saw the look. I suddenly panicked. I saw the look in your eye. <laughs> where you just went, but if I had one of your books, I'd know. Exactly, yes. you would know because there's diagrams in it. Yes, oh, so, that's good. <laughs> so that helps. I'm just going to pick it up just to yes. flick through a couple of the pages if that's okay. Because again, it's all about the quality. It's yes. about lots of images. It's about lots of tips and tricks and information because the thing is what I love about my job and what I love about my job here is the ability to educate people yes. because I remember when I was learning to sew I remember the very first class that I went to the first day when I started making a quilt block I was hooked within seconds Were and you? then I had to wait a month for the next class Aww. and it nearly killed me because I'm not known as a patient person okay. you know if I want to do something I want to do it now yes. and I want to do it I really want to do it like that yes I want to get I want to get in there and, yeah. and get learning so and over the years I've learned lots of things that I wasn't told when I was first as a beginner yeah so I try to put all of those things into my patterns and my guides it doesn't say you know get to the end and go and bind yes it shows you step by step Love how that. to bind um, and this is as I said this is a guide that will help you um, work with other patterns do your own designs you, you know you want to work with white shaped seams with hexagons how do you do it this will tell you. Perfect. Thirteen pounds and ninety-four pence. Two eight four nine seven nine. Your item number. You can, of course, divide everything into two payments if you want to on Flexi. So six pounds and ninety-seven pence today. Uh, next, we have the which one is next? The the birds and the bears. Yes, the, birds, the birds and the bees. Exactly, because uh, the fabric yep. is that I used for this pattern is my birds of paradise. Oh, okay. So, but the pattern is called the block itself is called Bearpaw. Ah, there you go. But again, one of the things I love about quilting. Up. One of the things that I love about quilting is the history. Yes. And actually, I do explain to you at the beginning here how they get the what names they've had oh. so this this block here is known as bear paw but it's also known as duck's foot in the mud <laughs> um hand of friendship tea leaf design or illinois turkey track wow how, you see it's so fabulous it's so evocative so those are the bits that they used to take out of my articles <laughs> now i get to leave them oh. in <laughs> Do you think, can you tell I'm texting you about that? They used to take my just, my, a, just a little bit. By the way, you turned to camera, um, but you know what? I love that. I love that because now you don't eat yourself. Exactly, and exactly. we like that. So, <laughs> eleven pounds and sixty-nine pence. Again, you can divide the cost of this into two payments. Seven, uh, nine eight seven seven eight three is your item number. Let's have a look at this. So this um, is the let's quilt this up. that the pattern makes. Wow. So that is nine nine blocks. Wow. So but you could just make it bigger if you wanted to. So this is your Illinois turkey track or your duck in duck the foot. In, duck in, no, duck's duck's foot in the, in the mud. Foot. Duck's, duck's, duck's foot. foot in the mud. Oh, I've got to be careful you know? how I say that. Yeah. I'll let you say that. <laughs> <laughs> But this, uh, this actually, um, I have this in my in Myrtle, my camper van. Oh. So because you know, if you if you pull up somewhere and you're a bit chilly, yeah, she's just the right size. Perfect. Or over, this is just the right size to go over. You know, your sleeping bag or yeah. anything like that, or sit on. Oh, isn't that lovely? And it's Rather just a cuddle underneath. It's just beautiful. Exactly. Um, do you know what this would look absolutely fantastic in? Your one day special fabrics. It would. It would if indeed. There's any left? You can check those out on the website. Um, stunning that is. Yes, that's beautiful. Quarters will make this. Wow, I love that. I love all the colours you've got in there right we're moving on we've got another book for you again I'll, what I'll do is I'll pick them up as we go through them so I can show you uh, this one is your diamond hexagon quilt pattern um, if you're watching at home Catherine Sturrock I think this is one for you she loves hexagons uh, everybody know. keeps saying that to me she, so. loves, she loves a hexagon she certainly does this is foundation paper piece so you do use with it um, a piece of quilters grid okay which has got uh, uh, here, here you go. It's got diagonal lines drawn on it, so equilateral triangles drawn on it. Um, this is actually a version of it made up. Okay. So you've got the I'll, green version there. I'll but this was down. made again by my friend Deborah, and she's done this in Christmas fabrics. Ooh. And look how different it looks. Yeah. It's the same pattern, but she's just mixed it up a bit by adding these. So these are actually log cabins, yeah. but they're triangular log cabins instead of the square variety. Oh, interesting. Well done, Debbie. That is fabulous. Yes, she's done a good job uh, there. 188055 is your item number. Again, you can spread the cost into two payments of £5.85. Right, I'll pick it up again. 
Next along, we have the medallion quilt. Yes, yeah, so a medallion quilt is something with a block in the middle and multiple borders. Okay. So when I was talking about wanting to add borders with those longer pieces, yep. this is ideal because you can put sections in between you know, yes. to, to make your quilt bigger. And you've actually got four different designs or four different blocks made in this pattern. So this pattern shows you how to do the economy square, which is in the middle. There you've got your flying geese and your half square triangles. And then you've got log cabins around the outside. And you can see, I go full on with the pictures. Yes. You know. <laughs> but that's good, you know, because you can, you know, you learn by reading, but also seeing pictures, I think it's yeah. fabulous. I'm definitely a visual learner. Yes. Um, and we've got my little Sarah Says. Oh, what do you say? Around. Well, I don't know what I've said there. Uh, oh, I'll, I'll, I'll just turn it to me. I've not got my glasses on, but I'll read it. Remember, this is your quilt, and you can choose how you want to quilt it. Stitch in the ditch or echo quilting with a walking foot is also acceptable. Just go with your guts, but remember, you can be brave and try something new as well. There you go. Sarah says. There you go. Do Sarah sold. says. Love that. <laughs> <laughs> so let's have a look. At so this the is quilt. this is this is the quilt. Ooh, wow. And I have actually free motioned this one. I was having I was having real fun doing this. Um, wow. So I free motioned in all of the gaps. But as I said, you've got the economy square in the middle, yep. flying geese, half square triangles, and your log cabins. That's amazing. That's beautiful. That is very striking. Beautiful. Thank you. Right. Uh, I do like making stuff. Yeah. <laughs> seven, uh, I think it's fabulous. Seventeen pounds and nine pence, but you can of course divide the cost into two payments, four seven six at five seven two. And using Flexi, of course, enables you to multi buy if you want to go for one or more of these fabulous pattern books. Okay, I'll pick this one up. Next we've got, we've a bit got festive. The, yeah, the reindeer scene wall hanging pattern. Yes, so this um, is a, 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 a applique, basically. So this is an applique project. Now, one of the things I really hate about applique patterns is when you get to the back and it says um, photocopy or enlarge this Ooh, pattern. Oh, let's see if it says it. Nope. Ah, look what we've got at the back. Everything has been designed yes. so that it fits onto A4 or two sheets of A4 so that you don't have to photocopy oh, and perfect. faff about because I hate faffiness. We don't want any faff. We don't right. want faff. What, what's the top tip from Sarah in this one? I can't remember. Tip. This is called a walking foot, not in capitals a, a running, running foot. foot. Keep your speed slow as you stitch. Do you know what? Yeah, that is so true. <laughs> yeah, because I was like, <laughs> yeah, the other day. With it my jiggles sewing all machine. over. It yep. does. Yeah, yeah, absolutely right. That's a top tip. Can we have a look at the quilt? <laughs> yes, We've we got can. It here. So I have this up all year round because this hangs up in my office. Oh. Um, in Peterborough, with uh, um, behind the door, and oh, it's that's just lovely. cheerful and. You know, you could do all sorts of things with it. You could hang little pouches on it for an advent calendar yeah, or something like that. Yeah, that'd be a like good that. idea. That's really um, nice. Yeah, so this will teach you a plique. You've got some piecing along here as well. And then you can really go to town on the quilting. In the last one, we talked about echo quilting. That's yep. what I've done here, which means you basically echo an existing line. Rather than sewing on the line, you're sewing around it. So, you know, great fun. Yeah. Um, and it becomes something that will come out, even if you do use it every Christmas, it comes out as part of your Christmas decorations. Yeah, we like that. Uh, very busy for the books, actually. Uh, again, you can divide the cost on Flexi. That's two payments of nine pounds. Right. Free motion. Yes. Yeah, so this again is a guide. Okay. So this is a guide to free motion embroidery. Okay. okay. Um, but I'd have popped two patterns in there to help you as well oh, get your practice in there. So two little house patterns. So um, this is house on a hill. Uh, it shows you how to use your bonder web or heat and bond in order to create your applique, and then how to stitch and add detail. So I do have the original here. Okay. So that you can see a bit a bit more Ooh. of that. Oh, 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 I'm sliding it that There you go, look. <laughs> oh. So something like this, this is a great way to practice if you've not done yeah. your free motion before, because it's all about scribbling. Yes. So it's all about, you know, it's not following lines, oh. it's not perfect curves, it's just getting you used to using your machine with your feed dogs down. Okay. Do we need a special foot to do this? You're, you're for your free motion foot, yeah. yes, you do. Okay. But if you've got the 180, you get it free anyway. That's perfect. The That's not the walking Sorry. foot, it's the other that, one. That was, that was my question, because I've got the 180. But your hopper, the, the white thing that hoppers. Oh, that, is that, that what it's for? That's ah. what it's for. <laughs> Ah, I'm not for keeping my pen in. Right, £15.49. <laughs> 018938 is your item of I know. 
<laughs> you can divide the cost into two payments if you want to. Um, and we do have that brother machine on the show. It's at the bottom of the screen. It is worth every single penny. Three three four two zero nine is your item number. Right, let's talk fabrics to go with the projects. Uh, we've got five half meters here. We and the have whole bundle is just twenty seven pounds and ninety five pence. Absolutely gorgeous. What we have here is a very sort of summery. I can't look at you now. <laughs> you you put your pen in it. Oh dear, oh dear. Um, but very gardenable. Yes. You know things like uh, if you like your gardening and you want to keep your secateurs in. Yeah. Perhaps you want like a tool An belt. Yeah, yeah. A tool belt would be With lovely. With pockets, I'd all like of that, that sort of thing. Or you've got um, a little. I made little boxes yes. when we launched this to put my seeds in. Oh, that'd be lovely. You know things you like that. You could make little lavender bags as well. You which could. Would be really and these nice. are just beautiful. To I mean, those could go on your cards. Yes. Couldn't they? They would be absolutely beautiful and so we've got a sort of garden bee theme here with some gorgeous coral oranges you've got pinks you've got lilacs in there you've got the bright yellows which are then sort of repeated across the range yeah um, just absolute st absolutely stunning range yeah, gorgeous and I love this one as well reminds me of blockbusters can I have a pee please Bob <laughs> um, absolutely stunning absolutely stunning great um, price as well you're saving nine pounds and 79 pence and you can can um, divide the cost into two payments. <laughs> Three nine two nine double five. Your item number. They're telling me I can't have a pee. Listen, if I want to pee, I'll have one. They asked Bob for one, and Bob gave him one. <laughs> They're right. not going to last one. <laughs> Every time. Uh, Every right. time. We've also got a fat quarter <laughs> bundle if you want that. If you don't want your half meters, you've got your fat quarters at nine pounds and ninety nine pence. Do you know what? It'd be worth going for both sets actually. Nine four three one one five is your item number, and that's for your fat quarters. Uh, we've got another book from Sarah. Uh, for you. Um, you could have a whole library of books from Sarah. It'd be amazing. <laughs> I, might, I might buy them all and then get one of those um, vans and go around villages and, and rent your books out. <laughs> what I get, like, a Sarah, like, like a library, you mean? Yes, yes. <laughs> Mobile library. You might have a library. Well, oh, thanks. Oh dear. Uh, right. If you want to go for the Sarah Payne's Applique School, we've got that for you. Uh, we've also got Sarah Payne's Quilt School as well. We had an email in the earlier show from, I think it was Julie from Leicester, um, and she wanted to know, that, you know, how to put together a quilt and hints and tips. And how this to would learn. be a really good mm. book. Definitely. Yes. So both of those books are designed to um, be sort of starter guides, and I put everything in that first one book. You know that I said I wish I knew when I learnt to quilt. Yes, um, I put everything in there. So brilliant, and brilliant. It's set out in lessons to take you through step by yeah. step. You can dip in and out if you want to, um, or you can start from the very basics and wait all the projects. And some people have. Yeah, and that's just twelve pounds and ninety nine pence. Um, which is a great price, it really, really is. So treat yourself, learn the right way, it's really important. Uh, right, we've got more fabric for you. Um, <laughs> shall we start with, oh, the, with galaxy. the galaxy? Galaxy? <laughs> the galaxy. Shall we have a look at the galaxy fabric? Um, can I get it out? Yes, you can. Okay, thank you. I need right. to lie down. <laughs> and the excitement of the last show has just finished me off. Well, it was fantastic. <laughs> Sarah's one day special. Oh my goodness, we were so busy. Uh, right is beautiful so this one has got your zodiac on it it's yep. got your star signs Ooh, on it lovely. absolutely gorgeous with um little elements of gold oh. in it you've got gold metallic co uh, uh, design on here as well it's very hard to see on the screen but this these elements in these stars here that is i can think you can just about see the reflection oh lovely you can just see it there and then in the center of these these bits here. Yeah. Oh, there we go. See, yeah, there you, you can go. just see, see the metallic. gold metallic detail on there. Absolutely uh, gorgeous. Did anyone see the meteor shower last night? We had a meteor we shower did, throughout yes. the night. We um, did, yes. I live somewhere very dark, Do so you? I did try and have a look. Did However, you see the moon was really bright. It was, yes. yes. Sturgeon moon. There you go. There you go. It's very bright. Um, another, uh, talking of moons, we've got the moon and the sun just here. And those beautiful gold. There you go. There you go. Always pulling it back, you see. Always I did, I did watch the SpaceX land. Did you? Yeah, when that when that came down, landed on a barge oh. yesterday. You know when the when Elon Musk's um, SpaceX 
They landed on a barge? Yeah, they landed it. Oh, in Rutland? No, not in Rutland. Oh, I thought you meant you saw it land on a <laughs> no, barge No, I wish. In that, uh, wouldn't that be awesome, that wouldn't would. it? Would. Yes. But no, I did watch that. I couldn't see the, um, the meteor shower, but never mind. <laughs> um, now, here's a lovely galaxy. You've got your stars here. <laughs> this is like a meteor shower, isn't it? <laughs> it is. It's beautiful. A complete shower. Uh, so... <laughs> So there we go. Again, we've got those gorgeous gold elements on there, and you, they stitch wow, beautifully. You don't have to one. you don't have to stitch round them or anything. You can stitch through them. Yes. Then they're they're really good quality. It's not going to flake. It's not going to crack. Um, I love the colours that you've got in here because you've got the blues. You've also got yes. the greens. You've also got the purple yes. as well. So again, we have here some of the signs of the zodiac. That's upside yeah. down. Oh, is it? Uh, yeah. So you've got the. You've got Pisces and all of all Aries. of Taurus and Scorpio. So yeah. what are you? I'm in Aries. What You're are you? You're in Aries. I'm Libra. Are you? Yes. Tall and willowy, apparently. Tall and willowy? Yes. Physically. Bit of balance sometimes. Well, yeah, completely. That, that bit may be but true. But we like that. Can't make a decision. We like that. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> but the tall and willowy just went terribly wrong. Um, but, yeah. <laughs> I like that. Um, I was going to say we would make a great couple, <laughs> but what I mean is, what I mean, what I mean, well, we would, we would, we would. We would. Uh, but what I mean is, Libra and Aries um, are like, yes, they, they are love signs, <laughs> friends, but more like yeah, my mum's Aries. Yeah. Um, <laughs> let's move on. It's <laughs> Right, there's a half metre bundle at the bottom of the screen, uh, or you can buy the fat quarters. It's entirely up to you. Eight ninety nine for your fat quarters, twenty seven ninety five for your half metres. I just think they are lovely. They make beautiful. a great quilt. They would, mm. and also really lovely cushions. So if you've got somebody in the family who's really interested in astrology or astronomy, yes. or you know, just perfect all of that, then then they uh, go. Right, so we have got birds of paradise. So this is my look? last range. Let this is this is what I would previously, uh, up until yesterday, called my current range. <laughs> Okay. Yes, because but, we launched your new range yes. tonight. So this was based. I designed this in lockdown after yes. watching far too many episodes of Death in Paradise. Oh dear. So and other other murder mysteries in are the Caribbean available. are probably available. But you know the bright colours. I was inspired by the the, the bright colours, the sunshine. The birds are mythical, but the plants are. We've got hibiscus, and we've got oh. And I haven't got the original pictures with me for these, but again, I did the same thing. So big, strong paintings on A3 yes. that then become all of these elements. And we do exactly the same thing there about talking about layering and sizing. And so we've got that in the white. That's beautiful. Is this your hibiscus? Uh, no, this is actually a cherry blossom. Cherry blossom. Cherry blossom, yep. yep. And then for, oh, this is, these fabrics are gorgeous aren't they thank you yeah. so these are very we're talking reds we're talking turquoise yes. we're talking sun sea surf you know uh, fruit um uh, rainforest all of beautiful. yeah absolutely look mm. at that i love the variegation of the color in that 11 pounds and 69 pence 203 691 is your item number if you want to go for the birds of paradise you've got two options you've got royal and the navy do you want to open this one as well whilst we're yeah, here why not? yeah why not why <laughs> not why not? Because it's nice to see, isn't it? Uh, so we have got your beautiful... That's the one you've just opened. That's the one I've just opened. Hang on. Here we've got... No, I've... no this have one... Mixed... No. No. That's those. Is that those? <laughs> yes. What then where's my other one? How bizarre. One, two, three. Oh, I think they've got mixed up. Hold oh. on. How... Hold on. Hold on. So I... that's... That's I did. In there. I did wonder how they got mixed up because I opened. I did you I, did you sneakily open up the rest underneath the fabrics? No, I didn't. But I had these. These are my samples from the last show. So I think somebody's opened them up, mixed them up, and ah, put them back in again. So so here's here we a go. picture. Thank you. So that's your royal. <laughs> <laughs> So that's what you just wonder. opened. Yeah, that's uh, so that's, and that's the navy, so you can see the difference there, um, which is great. There you go. We've got them <laughs> sorted here. Uh, Eleven pounds and sixty-nine pence. Do you know what? Such a great price, and if you can afford to, why don't you go for both? And if you are dividing the cost um, on your flexi, if you do go for both sets, it's eleven sixty nine today and eleven sixty nine in a month's time. But if you just want one, then divide the cost of that into two payments, which is five pounds and eighty five pence.
Uh, right. Also, now, very quickly, if yes. you are making the quilt, mm -hmm. you will need both bundles because it needs ten, ah. it, fat, ten fat quarters. Well, nine fat quarters. Ooh. It needs nine or ten fat quarters. So there you, you know, go. you will Excellent. need you will need those. Um, so. Can we talk about that lovely machine that you've got next we to you? We can indeed. This is the machine that I went for. I've and never I sewed before. In uh, well, I have when I was probably you know school. Um, used to sew things to my skirt um, by accident. Yes, but not used the sewing machine until I bought this one from Create and Craft, and I love it. It is an absolutely fantastic machine. Um, it's an amazing machine as a first machine yes. as well because the, my first machine cost me two hundred and fifty pounds, mm. and it was mechanical That's and big. it only had eight stitches, oh. and I outgrew it in six months. Yeah. So what you've got here is a, the, uh, when I say to people, what, I, I get asked this all the time, what machine should I go for? And I say go for the best that you can afford. Yes. But also go for the machine for the for the sewer you want to be. Alright? So if you want to make quilts, yes. don't buy one that just does a straight stitch and you think, well it'll do for now. Because yes. you'll outgrow it so quickly and then you'll be disappointed. So what you want to do is go for a brand that you've heard of, which we've all heard of Brother, because yes. we we grew up with Brother printers, yeah. Brother label makers, um, you know, they've got the scan and cut, yes. all of those amazing products and they're so good at making things easy to use yeah. and that's exactly what they've done with their sewing machines as well. Now it's called the 180 because it comes with 180 built-in stitches so that is one thing you can't change you cannot add more stitches okay. to a machine but 180 okay. 180 is quite a lot it is and actually you probably spend 90 percent of your time using 10 percent of those yes so things like stretch stitches if you want to do dressmaking you need your stretch stitches you want your buttonhole stitches yes. you want your zigzag stitches you want your overcast stitchings all of those um, but there are times where you'll want those decorative stitches yeah. as well so also it has an amazing um, a, a motor with it because that's another thing you can't change. Yes. You cannot change the power of the motor and the quality of the motor. This does 560 stitches a minute so it's going to be nice and whizzy if you need it. So yes. if you're taking up maybe you're making a dress and you've got you know a full skirt yes. and you're sitting there hemming and you begin to think oh my goodness is this ever going to end? You want a machine that's going to just plow yeah. through that. But you also have your speed control on here. So this is like a limiter on your car. Yes. You know when you've got you can't go any faster so you can set it whatever speed you like and then you don't go any faster than that. Okay. So even if you put your foot down on the accelerator, yes. it's going to keep going. Okay. You've, you've got a backlit LCD screen here which will allow you to select your stitches and then you can override stitch length and stitch width so that it's perfect for whatever you want. We also have two built-in fonts in here which... Oh, there we go. There go. Two built-in fonts. You've got italic and bold, so you can do text. You can do, you know, telephone numbers if you want to sew and a label in your gym kit. And do you do those one at a time? So you do the A, and then you'll change the stitch nope. to like. So what you do is it'll take I think up to I want to say 32. It might be 38. I can't remember. But you program into it, you know. So I could put Sarah Payne made this. I didn't um, know that. And then you stitch and stitch and stitch and stitch and stitch. This is where I should read the instructions. It would help. And the manual. You I'm also get a DVD with it, which might be worth you yeah, actually I know, watching. I know. I'm so rubbish at that. I'm the kind of person who just gets it out of the box and just at 100 miles an hour. You could do that too. The yeah. manual though is exceptional. It and is. Somebody, it's very good. In, in my previous life, one of I, I used to be, um, I used to do all sorts of techie things like yeah. you did. And for a while I was a tech author. Yes. Uh, for manuals. And um, the ma so I know what makes a good manual. Yes. And this is a brilliant manual yeah. so it will tell you all sorts of things that will help you on your sewing journey but also now there's an app the brother support center app that you can download and it will have information about your scan and cut all your sewing machines embroidery machines even the ones that are exclusive to us Excellent. you can have in there so you can find information and details about that too because brother always at the forefront yeah. of um, you know developments and they talk to quilters they talk to sewers they know what we want yes and then they give it to us I think it's fantastic I really do the first thing I made with it was uh, a mini quilt yes you did um, yeah. I, I bought a, uh, is it a charm pack so I just did something really easy and I just sewed them all together you did uh, and I thought it looked fabulous it's on my Facebook page if you want to go and have a look at it it's my first time and I just went for it I you know, it probably wasn't exactly meeting up where it should, but it looks fine to me. Mm. And the second project after that, I thought, Do you know what, I'm just going to give this a go. And I made um, a tablet wallet for Jane. Well, that's the thing. It's about courage. You yes. just do your first steps. Right. And the thing is, if you don't, 
start you don't learn exactly and that's so true and also don't be too hard on yourself because when you've made the first thing okay the points don't match up perfectly mm. or your intersections don't but you look at the antique ones that are in the quilters exhibitions yeah. neither do they oh you so know, maybe it's all right then. yeah it's fine just enjoy the process enjoy yes. the learning um and there's so much to learn when you've yes. got a sewing machine you can do functional things so you can take up trousers yeah. and, and you become very popular as i know I've oh got new, yes i've got more jobs to do <laughs> now after coming in today but you know <laughs> you can so it can be very functional it can also be changing the look of your home decor Mm -hmm. It could be, you know, taking in or letting out items of clothing, yes. taking up trousers, but then it's fun things like, hey, make, it, make yourself a dress out of your favourite fabric, yeah. make yourself a quilt, make somebody else a quilt, um, make make gifts, make, yes. make things that you can sell. It you know. really is a fantastic deal and being able to divide the cost into four payments means you only pay 83 and three pence today, 83 pounds and three pence a day, plus your PMP. Then there'll be another payment after that, another payment after that, another payment after that. We'll sort it all out. It's interest free as well. So you don't have to take out any interest on this. So it's interest free payments. And there's also a little surprise drawer there, isn't there, where you get your goodies? Yes, you've got your storage in here and it's all moulded, but you also get extension, extension cable with yes. it. Yes. Sorry, extension table, table with it because this slides off and you can put your extension table on there yep. so you've got more workspace. It comes with a hard cover, a hard yep. dust cover, which does have polystyrene in it. Don't take it out. Yes, I yes. did by accident. You told me not to, I so did, then I, I, did. I stuck I did. it back in. It's moulded. It's yes. moulded to protect the top. Yes, you is. also get your free motion grip with it, which helps you do your free motion stitching. You get a free motion foot, a walking foot, and a quarter of an inch foot with it too. Excellent. Do we get you? <sighs> No, unfortunately. Oh. But you can find me on Facebook okay. and social right, media. Then. Yeah, I'm okay. all over the place. Okay. Um, do you know what? It's a terrific machine to go for. I'm really enjoying my um, journey that I've started. And um, I can't wait to do some more stitchy And that's projects. exactly what it is. It's a journey. You yes. start and then you move along. Yeah. And as you get more and more adventurous and yes. more and more experienced, yeah. Who make knows? more and more stuff. Um, my next project is going to be a quilt for my new great niece, Chloe. Oh. I went to see her the other day. Oh. Oh, she's so beautiful. How old is she? Chloe is, I think, probably about 10 days, oh. two weeks old. <laughs> Tiny. She's got long legs, though. She's going to be a footballer. Already decided. She has I no was, choice in this. Um, I was holding her, and uh, we were talking about women's football, because uh, my nephew is a coach for football, and we were saying, oh, yeah, she's going to be a great women's footballer, and she just opened her eyes and looked at me like that. That's the sign for me. There you go. And she's beautiful. She's, be she's going to be a striker. <laughs> But whatever she, whatever she decides to do, is all right. But everybody in my family gets a quilt. Yes. Um, because quilts are traditionally given at births, they're given at weddings. Yeah. Um, you know, they're at times of trial. You see people being wrapped up in blankets, yeah. and people donate quilts for those oh. things because you know you, it goes against your skin. It keeps you warm. Yes. It's comforting, and there's just something very personal. Yeah. I think about a quilt made yeah. for you. I think that's lovely. Oh, they found a picture of my quilt, which is uh, nice. And the, there was a picture. Also, where you got that from, maybe of the um, tablet case as well, because I was quite proud of that. Oh, you should be. I found a piece of ribbon, because I didn't have any attachments. I didn't have any buttons or attachments. So I found a button, and I found a ribbon, and I just got the ribbon, and I folded it in half and made stitched it all the way around. Yeah, mm. made a little loop, and then a little patch to go over it as yeah. well. So, you know, and I was, I was really proud of that. You should be. I was really proud of that. And that's what it's all about. It's about confidence. It did stay in the box for a while. Yes. And I kept telling you it's in the box. We did keep and having yeah. conversations. I said it's not doing any good yeah, in the box. You told, me, you told me to get it out. So I did get it out. There you go. And here it is. That's my first make there. That See, was a mode of fabric. That's lovely. That is so lovely. And, you know, that's, that's something that... It, forever you'll look back on that and you go that's the first thing I made yeah you're right you're mm. right so I've got the wadding for it I've got to put the backing on it and put a border around it so that's yes. my next job uh, with that so I'm excited about that mm -hmm. and I'll let you know how that goes but if you do want to get hold of the brother machine 83 pounds at three pence today it really is a great price you're saving 366 pounds <laughs> yes <laughs> I wonder what that, what, what happened then I saw the look on your face I didn't realize it was that much yes. the saving mm-hmm this is a this is a good machine. I've got a good, I've got a great machine. You have got a great machine. And actually, I have two of these, um, and I use them um, 
I have them in my workshops when I have wow. people come to learn with me because I know I can sit somebody in front of this machine and they'll be sewing confidently with it in just a few well, minutes. It's so what, easy to use. With the, with, with, the, with the money that you're saving, it's like a two for the price of one, isn't it, if you go for it two? Is, yeah. Wow. <laughs> uh, tell your friends. 334-209 is your item number. Okay, we uh, are here on Create and Craft, but of course we have our sister channel, Craft Extra. Roll up, roll up. For more crafting on Craft Extra, read all about it. For more inspiration from your favourite crafting brands, tune in to the red button on Freeview 85, Sky 673 and Freesat 817 and YouTube to watch us on Craft Extra. Every weekday at 10am, 11am, 1pm and 2pm you will find four dedicated live shows. Craft Extra for your extra dose of crafting. Oh, it's great to have your company. Great to be with Sarah as well for the next 28 minutes. And then, Sarah, you're going to be back at 9 o'clock with your one-day special. If there's anything left. If there's anything left. We had a phenomenal show earlier on. Let's talk about the books uh, that you've got available. Uh, Sarah, how long have you been writing books for? Well, I've been writing patterns for probably, professionally, so mm. for probably about 10 years now, 9, 10 wow. years. But obviously, I've been doing the books, and I've been doing, um, when I was teaching classes, I would people would leave with a pattern. I do my hampers, which mm. are subscription every three every three months. People get sent a hamper with a pattern Fabulous. in it. But this is my new range and this is a, a very new format. Um, I've been working with um, a graphic designer who's been helping me make it all look yes. beautiful. Um, but it's all about getting education out there because the number of times that people contact me and they say, I saw that sample on your show. How did you do it? Yeah. You know, so I thought that's what I'm going to start doing and I'm going to try do it with um, as many of the samples that I make as possible actually photograph them as I'm making them for shows Super. so that we like we did with the layer cape yes. one so that not only do you get to see what you can make but you get to find out how to do it as well isn't that great should we show the sample first and then the book yes. because we'll entice you in we'll start with the first one yeah so this one's actually a guide so okay. this is not this is not a quilt that's in it but this is uh, a quilt made oh, with half square wow. triangles so this, uh, I actually called this noughts and crosses. Yeah, it, just, um, <laughs> it does look like noughts and crosses. But these are half square triangles. Yes. And this block here is called a friendship star. Oh, and that's it was originally sweet. called a friendship star because back in the um, late 1800s, yeah. lots of women left the UK to go and start new lives in America, mm -hmm. and they would often be going over there to get married. They wouldn't have any, uh, wouldn't know many people over yeah. there. But what their friends would do back in England would each make one of these blocks and write their name in the How centre. Lovely. So it, they they would then be given a finished quilt with all of their friends Aww. have made this block, so they could take it with them because at that time they probably would never see their friends and family again oh, that's so sad. that it, that's why they call them friendship stars uh, right I'm gonna pick up the book as we go along so this is your guide to shaped seams and angles yes. would you say for a beginner this would be an excellent book it to is go it's for? not a pattern, a pattern. Yeah, it's, it's a not it's a guide okay. so it tells you if you want to do hexagons how do you do hexagons how do you get Y shaped seams how do you deal with diamonds um, then if you want to do flying geese lots of different ways to yeah. do flying geese Geese. and then also how to do multiples of your half square triangles yeah. as well so this is more of a guide so that you can go off and do other things so yeah. like this one the one we've just shown that pattern I've just shown you if you need to do you know eight half square triangles this yeah. will tell you how to do eight in one go instead of you know, four lots of two. I like that. Do you know what? I really like the way it's laid out as well. That yes. You've got the blocked areas in blue, so you've got those focal points to go to. Uh, it's very appeasing to the eye, which is always important for you creatives. £6.97 <laughs> today, another payment in a month's time. We'll take your P&P on the first one. You can, of course, give us a call on 01733 or head to the website to make your purchases. Right, and that's createandcraft.com. Your next one, let's show you yes. the quilt. So this is my... Bear Paw, or Illinois Turkey Track, or Duckfoot in, in the, the Mud. mud. Yes. You know, all of these names. Um, but this again uses half square triangles. So you need multiples mm. of those. And that first guide tells you how to make multiples. Wow, look at that. So That's this, impressive. Is a, this is a good pattern for a beginner because the thing is, it looks complex, but it's really not. And okay. that's the thing about quilting. Everything is broken down yes. into smaller and smaller parts. It's all about getting straight edges. Yes. You know, Which... and that really helps. So accuracy. Oh. Um, 
There's no such thing really if you're working with a traditional block like this yeah. as a hard block. Okay. It just means there's more components to it. And you've got all the information in there, great photographs as well, um, and very, very easy to read and follow. And then you have those tips from Sarah along the way. Yes, and with the patterns, you'll see on the centre of e on the first page of each one, there will be a blue block. So yes. not on the guides, just on the patterns. There'll be the blue block that will tell you what you need. Yes. Or, and it may tell you the fabric that I've used. Now, that doesn't mean that they're going to be available forever, but it yep. gives you an idea. And then the orange, or the, this is more of a salmon pink, yeah. That will tell you, you know, your remembers, yes. the things. So all of your patterns, when you come on the inside, that will be on there, there yeah. for you. So you can get used to how the pattern is written. That's fantastic. Uh, 987783 is your item number for that. And it's two pence of five pounds and 85 pence. The next one is the hexagon diamond it quilt. It is. Now yes. this was made for me by Deborah, my friend Deborah. Well so this Deborah. is a, a triangular tri Triangular log cabin, don't you know? That's <laughs> got someone else's Triangular teething. log cabin. That's the word, yes. yes. So this is a log cabin is usually square and yep. this is a triangular version. Okay. And we use um, like foundation piecing yep. to do that, it gives you lines to, to sew yep. on. Um, but it's a really fun project. It could be something to go in the centre of your Christmas table, yep. you know, or you could make it in different colours and put it on your patio table Fantastic. maybe. Um, now, if you want to go for the book, again, you can divide the cost into two payments of five pounds at 85 pence. And again, it's beautifully laid out, really nice to read, and you've got that glossy cover as well. So it's very posh. And 11 like pounds, fancy. yeah, 11 pounds and 69 pence, 188055 is your item number. We also have other um, books of uh, patterns available for you as well. You can find all of them on our website. We have got our free motion and uh, which is the end one I'll pick this one up yes because you may be wondering why they're different prices because they're different sizes yes so okay. they're priced based on how much the, the printers because yeah. obviously the bigger they are the more they cost to yeah. print yeah uh, 15 pounds and 49 pence and you've got your patterns in the back 018938 is your item number six pounds and 97 pence every time I see that picture I actually think it's you standing there <laughs> <laughs> it's really throwing me. I just keep looking down and thinking, oh, look. I didn't think you were wearing that card again. I'll have to do them all again because I'm obviously going to change hair colour again <laughs> at least once this year. Honestly, it keeps throwing me. I'm like, what are you doing there? <laughs> right, let's have a look at the website. That's where you can go to to see all of the um, patterns and books available for you. We have got um, items from So Easy for you. We've got graph paper. We've got hexagon templates. Oh, we've got some wadding as well. And you can see the five star reviews on that. We've also got some jumbo uh, clips for you. Oh, I love the them. jumbo wonder clips, which um, shopping online are available for you. Craft has just got easier with PayPal's Pay in Three plan. Oh, hello! <laughs> I just rudely interrupted myself. So. I am so big-headed, I even interrupted myself. Janice, stop it. Right, let me, let me show you my big clips instead. It's just one of those days today, isn't I'm it? I'm terrible to myself. <laughs> I'm going to have a right word with myself on the way home. So rude to talk over each other on Awful. TV. It's very bad manners. <laughs> right, your big clips, what have you yes. got? So these are Jumbo Wonder Clips, and actually I'm going to see if I can just open the packet a little bit, because these are absolute genius. Now, you may have seen the small clips, I'm just looking to see if I've got any in my stash, but this is a Jumbo. Oh, they are Jumbo. So these are the standard ones, which are marvellous, great invention, because oh. they can really help us, you know, if you're sewing your wadding together, yep. or anything, you can't pin it, you just clip it. But this is... <laughs> Sorry, I've dropped one. She's so disruptive. Yeah, so the, these are fantastic, but these are mega. Look at those. It means that I can clip something massive. Yeah. It's, it's, she's such a child. <laughs> don't put them on your fingers. No, don't put them on your fingers. Because they'll hurt. They do. But you see also what you've got on the back of them. If I just turn them over, is you've got measurements on oh. the back. So it actually says the first one is quarter of an inch, half inch, three quarters of an inch, and an inch. So if you knew that you wanted to do something an inch in, what you do is you would line that up and you know that the along here there. is an inch. Oh. So it also opens up much bigger than a standard clip. Yeah. So you can do something that's much more poofy. So you know if you're looking at wadding, you want to clip thick wadding. Yes. You can. 
these so are fabulous. They are, and they're really strong. Yeah. And they go in a long way so that yeah. you can clip quite far into whatever you are putting together. So when I was making um, a cushion the other day for, for the other show, yeah. um, I've got quite thick uh, iron-on wadding there. And to hold it in place, I have my little jumbo clips. Oh, is it a pair? Uh, 24 pieces. Um, that is a fabulous still Look like little crocodiles, don't they? They do look like little crocodile uh, clips. £17.99. 135447 is your item number. I love them. Great to have the measurements on the back. Two payments of £8.99. <laughs> I'm going to put them away before she loses them. Pence. <laughs> Uh, now, we've got something else that um, we've been very, very busy for. Our lovely Matt will hand that in. Thank you, Matt. Oh, oh you're now, great. Paper. Yes. I use this quite a lot. Is it a twin pack? It Ooh. Oh, that's even better. Yeah. I use this quite a lot because I use it for designing some of my quilts. Do you? I draw them into here and then I can colour them in. Because what we've got is we've got our um, sort of your graph paper lines here. Okay, oh. so each each chunk yeah. of your graph, graph paper is separated into four rather than five. Okay. So if you get if you get graph paper from you know school, yeah, it's it's uh, got five separators, right? Whereas this has got four, so it means it's quarter inches, or it could I be half see, yeah. inches. I can see. So yeah. So this would be an inch, and that would be half an inch, and that would be quarter of an inch. Wow. So if you're using these to design, it's so, so much easier. Oh, that would be and brilliant. And literally, I do sketch, and when I'm bored, yeah. um, and I, or I can't sleep or something like that, I do get my pens out and I do colour in. It's very sad. Um, so I've got quite a few of these oh. bits and pieces, and I could go back and, yeah. and, and play with them. And also, yeah. you could go back and say, maybe, you know, you've created all of these blocks. Yeah. Then you cut them out, and then you go to the next page, and you put them back down again, and then you colour in like sashing or you think how would it look with this border and this border I oh, use great it's, it's amazing for designing your own quilts because designing your quilts is not actually that difficult yeah. people are often put off they think yeah. it must be harder than it is oh, I'm gonna design but, one now yeah then. Well, is that a challenge yeah why not shall I yeah because you've what you're doing here is you draw your design and then it's just about working out how much seam allowance you need to put into yeah. it so you know if you're working with squares you need to cut it if this was an inch yeah um, you would cut it an inch and a half because you've got a half, a half inch right quarter, well quarter inch either side yeah. if you are doing half square triangles you need to add an inch like we did on the last show okay yeah. so um so design, do your design and then work out the seam allowances afterwards oh. and you could play around with it so on here it's a full 12 inch 8 inch and 4 inch squares yes. uh for designing yes your so there's blocks. your four yeah there's your eight right and there's your 12. got you love that uh, you get 25 sheets in each which means you're getting 50 in total three pounds and 60 pence today another three pounds and 60 pence in a month's time your pmp will be on your first one that is fabulous so if we wanted to use our galaxy fabric you we could yeah we could mm -hmm. create and build a quilt so let's have a look at the galaxy fabric if you haven't seen this already what we'll do is we shall go through uh, the fabric so i will hand it all over <laughs> And then what we'll do is we'll peel it back okay. one by one. I think we'll do that on the overhead side. Okay, so I'll pop that there for you. Now, 70% of the stock has already gone of your fat quarter bundle. And there's also half metres as well, which would be great to go for. Absolutely beautiful. Now, these do have these gorgeous, rich purples and pinks, very spacey. Mm. Um, and then we've got the, the gorgeous... Um, gold elements on top here with the the moon and you've got the little stars here um, and just that little element and and when you've got gold or silver they're painted on the top ah, they're not dyed so they really? are applied to the top is that going to wash off if we wash it no, no. it's not if you feel it it yeah. feels exactly like the rest of the fabric because yeah, it it's really good quality wow. it doesn't scratch it doesn't crack it doesn't flake um, it will wash uh, it's supposed to and um, it's really really beautiful quality look at the detail on there as well and that tells you something about the quality of the fabric yeah. because you're coming right in here and you can read all of the text yeah. around it um, you can see all of the individual elements on there now if it's yeah. if it's um, uh, sort of you know a cheaper fabric yes. it tends to be coarser yes which means it yeah. doesn't print as well yeah so um, in order to get a decent print you need a nice smooth key it's like wow. think about super soft card compared yes. to watercolor paper when you're good stamping putting it good way of putting it yeah um, <laughs> love that if you love star signs astrology or 
What's the other one? Astronomy. Astro astronomy or astrology. Um, then this one to go for. This is just one of the fat quarters, though. We've got more. Um, so this is our this. star signs with the constellations. So we've got Libra and Capricorn and, well, all of them. I'm not going to read them all out. Pisces. Virgo, yeah. Taurus. Taurus. Um, Cancer. Yeah. Sagittarius. Capricorn. Uh, what else? Aquarius. Uh, have we said that one? Yeah. Uh, my, yeah. Uh, Leo. Leo, yeah. Leo, mm -hmm. yeah. Beautiful. There we go. So we've got them all, Aries. We've got them all on here. Do you know Aries is the head of the zodiac? Is it? Even though it's March, because the calendar used to start in March. It did. And Aries is the head, which mm. is what I am. Yes, and that's why October is the eighth month, and it's now the tenth month. Yes. Because they, they, they moved everything down. Yeah, they shifted it. Mm. So and when we moved, could be at the head. There we go. And when we moved to the Gregorian ca calendar, I think we gained 10 days as well. Or did we lose it? Anyway. Uh, I don't know. We might have lost it. Um, it next was a while up. ago. I don't yeah. think we noticed. I think I've lost it. <laughs> That's what they keep telling me. <laughs> <laughs> keep telling you, and they stop us working together because it's just... <laughs> But this one has got this beautiful sort of watercolour look behind yeah, I like it. That. With it, it's still you've got that wonderful shape. Um, with the, it's kind of. I was it's looking quite at Christmassy, it. isn't it? It is. But I was looking at this thing. Is that a dodecahedron? Like it would come up as a point that way. I'm trying to. A who do we do we do what? <laughs> How, I Dodec dodecahedron. Isn't that a, a twenty side? I'm going to stop now because it's very late. Dodecahedron. Dodecahedron. It's a shape. Dodecahedron. <laughs> the more you say it, the more dodecahedron. 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 I'm beginning to think now that I'm saying it wrong because no, you're not. Dodecahedron. No, you're saying it right. Dodecahedron. Yeah, so I'm wondering if that's what, what this is supposed. It? So it's got. Ah, uh, I see. I see what you mean. <laughs> Please don't email in and tell me I'm getting it all wrong because no. I probably know. <laughs> no, I get so, what you mean. Yeah, I think it's it's supposed to be. You know, you learn something every day. You learn something every day. I was just looking at it thinking, I wonder if that's what it is. But anyway, it's lovely. And it's got that beautiful gold again. And you've yeah. got the delicate gold behind with the little stars. And then you've got these wonderful blue patches, um, like a stormy sky. Yeah. It is it's quite just, Christmassy, though, isn't it? it? Is. I think you it's could, the gold. Yes, I and think the stars you, in yeah, there. Yeah, you put gold You put gold and stars on something and it does it could look be Christmassy. Very, yeah. It could be Christmassy. That's wonderful. I love this one. Now this, this makes beautiful. me think of, you know, when you've got um, those hanging things on your doors, yeah. you know, that keep the flies, flies away. Yes. <laughs> yes. So that's I've why I'm looking for some of those just recently. <laughs> But there you go. That's what this makes me think of. But again, you've got that. All the, this is all the metallic gold, and yeah. it's not creasing. It doesn't crack. You can sew through yeah. it. It's really good quality and well applied. Did we say we've got these in half meters as well? Our lovely Lottie. Wow! Imagine half meters in that. Beautiful. The details for the half meters are at the bottom of the screen. Twenty-seven pounds and ninety-five pence, which is an absolute bargain when you see the quality. Do you know what? Even the other side of that it's lovely. fabric. Lovely. Yeah is great to work with so you could use both sides in your projects which would look really nice and if you're in the club if you want to go for your half meters it's just 25 pounds or 16 pence that's a bargain that is good isn't it yeah that really is um yeah both sides of the fabric are really good to work mm. with right we've got the star we've and then the, we've got yeah we've got the moon, the moon and the sun um here with the cream background and then the gold detail wow. and actually i'm going to turn it the other way around just because you're looking at that sun upside down but again, see the detail that you're getting in this pattern because of the smoothness of the fabric. Oh, and there's the man in the moon, asleep. Yeah, having a nap. Yeah, he's having a mm. nap. Bless him. He does it, that a lot. He's not a sturgeon moon, though. No. Big and bright mm -hmm. and bold. Yeah, that's beautiful. Look at the sun as well and the stars. Uh, that would make, if you go for the half meter pack, mm -hmm. I'm just thinking that would be really nice, like a table runner or a tablecloth. It would. Special, like a special birthday. Yeah, because you've got that gold, so yeah. there's a sense of luxury. There's yes. a sense of, and, and with the, the detail on it, you've got that quality. Yeah, absolutely. Of, it's just beautiful, isn't it? Yeah, it certainly is. If you want to go for your fat quarters, 730510 is your item number. Been really busy for these, actually. Uh, and if you want, sorry, that's for the half meters. 730510 is for the half meters. And it's three payments of £8.39. pence. Or the fat quarters, which are at the bottom of the screen, eight ninety nine if you're in the club. And if you want to be get uh, sorry, if you want to become a club member, then it's triple five, triple five in your basket, twenty pounds for a whole year, but you get an extra ten percent off all your prices. Uh, right, what we're going to have a look at next? 
Oh, the birds of paradise. <laughs> oh dear. Oh dear. <laughs> the right. Mixed up. Do we have these sorted now? <laughs> no. Let's start. <laughs> I've got this one here. Can we? Can you show us this, a, a lovely picture, and I'll and we'll we'll sort <laughs> we'll them out. We'll try and work it out. Uh, let's have a look. So, birds of paradise. So, so stay on that one for a minute. Yes. Oh, so that's yes. That's this one. Yes. That one. Yes. Yes. That one. Uh, and then that one. That one. Not that one. Not that one. That one. Okay. So we've there got we go. that one right, Lottie. Uh, Two hundred three six nine one twelve ninety nine. And then we've got the the navy. Yes. So that's that one. That one. That one. That one. That, that one. one. That and one, that one. Uh, I've got one missing, which is that one. There okay. we go. Right, so we're sorted now. <laughs> yes. So we'll grab those. I'll take the, the celestial, lovely galaxy ones away. With and the we'll go, And we'll go and, and you de decahedrons. <laughs> de decahedrons. Oh, so de deca what's it? Yes, those yeah. ones. <laughs> um, okay, right. Let's have a look at these live because these are beautiful and these are Sarah's. Sarah designed these. I did. Which, which one? Are, the, are this your third design? This is the third, third range. Yes, these were designed during lockdown. So my first two was one was my trip to Nepal. Oh. And the second one was a trip to India. Oh, how so um, the third one, I was supposed to be going on a trip and just didn't. Obviously, everybody, oh, everybody yeah. didn't. So I spent a lot of time in the house watching telly. Oh, and but you made a beautiful <laughs> range of fabric. I started painting these. So these are hibiscus flowers. Yes. And cheese plants and ferns oh. and the uh, florals here, which are also on this one of the uh, birds of paradise. Oh, they lovely. So and those were. Uh, was watching that TV show and they had um, they walked up the side of this house one day and there was just thousands of these wow. and I went oh I need I need to paint some of those so this is actually a mythical bird of paradise here it's not a real bird okay but again he's he's about a three size he's yes. quite he's quite large yeah. that I painted him you know but um, we take these elements and then I'm working with a graphic designer who takes my ideas um, and adds to them yeah. and, and basically well the thing is I don't have the technical ability to turn to turn my designs yes. into this yeah. so I'm looking at this this comes back and I'm saying you know what there's too much gapping here we need something to go in it can we take the dots from here ah, you know really and, then, well. and then we repeated those dots because I then stuck the dots on the paintings that yes. I did of this yeah. and that's repeated yeah. throughout do so you know what it's beautiful love the colors that you've got in here really like the way that sort of orangey red goes with the blue um, to make a shirt out of these like a patchwork shirt I've got a or top pair made of shorts, of this. Mm -hmm. a, a, a top yep. absolutely would look sensational. Oh, I'd love a summer shirt out of this. And I put uh, pockets in it too. Yeah, <laughs> that's your first option. So that is the the navy. Um, then we've got the royal. So I shall place the royal yes, down sorry. for you. And this has got that beautiful, vibrant orangey mm. red in there. With yes, your cherry this is blossoms. beautiful with my blossoms yeah. on it. Yeah, absolutely gorgeous. Your blossoms are lovely on there. They are. They are. And you know, I painted. I paint all of these, and then we take different elements from different the, the different images and put them all together because you don't want just plain red behind this. No. You want a bit of depth. I like that with to the it. Yes. So then we've got the white version Ooh, with the nice. um, with the bird of paradise, and again the same yep. background that you saw in the red one. Yes. So um, giving and the detail with the dots again. Isn't that gorgeous. Now this one, wow. I actually what actually happened with this is I painted this about this big. Did you? And I painted it in something called Payne's Grey because I thought that was quite funny. Yes. In fact, it's called Payne's Grey, <laughs> uh, which is a dark grey, and yep. then I. Um, painted with white all of these bits on top wow what so, were the dots all the dots and all of those when i bring Gosh. my i have to show my original but what um, a labor did, of love that I, is, I did it it was about this big and yeah. it nearly finished me off but i really wanted this kind of mottled effect in the background yeah and then we took that and i'd done it in gray but we turned it into the turquoise yes. and the very blue that's in the other bundle yeah. but yeah it's about giving depth and yeah. i really wanted this sort of feeling of lightness and darkness um and layering of colors um and i mean sometimes i'm literally sending them i go down to like B and Q or yeah. somewhere like that, and get the paint chips oh, okay. and send the paint chips up. And I'm going. This is the colour blue I want, and this one, and this one. Brilliant. So you've got the Pantone numbers. Yeah, that's so fabulous. That, um,
they know what they're working with. <laughs> Fabulous. A few more to show you from this collection. £12.99, pence, 203, 691. We've only got a minute left of this show. Wow. Sarah is time back go? at 9 o'clock tonight. Absolutely stunning range. Um, and if you love these designs, you're going to love the one day special as well. We were phenomenally busy for that. Uh, we've got some K Facet books on the website, lots of other items as well. Remember, anything you buy from this show, you will be entered into the prize draw to win over £2,000 worth of goodies uh, to which Sarah has contributed. Yes, unfortunately, we can't go in for that competition. I which know, is a shame. disappointing. Um, so lots and lots of different uh, accessories, goodies, um, uh, essentials on the show, threads for you, wadding. So do go and have a look. Pop them into your basket and do go and check out. Uh, Sarah, can I say a huge thank you? What a great to us. Thank, thank you. And I'll um, see you tomorrow. Yes, we'll be back again together. Hopefully. Well, hopefully, yes. I might just stay at home. <laughs> right, so let's discover stamps by me coming up next. After that, we've got the Craft Cotton Co. and Sarah Payne's British Waterways One Day Special. Roll up, roll up. For more crafting on Craft Extra, read all about it. For more inspiration from your favourite crafting brands, tune in to the red button on Freeview 85, Sky 673 and Freesat 817 and YouTube to watch us on Craft Extra. Every weekday at 10am, 11am, 1pm and 2pm, you will find four dedicated live shows. Craft Extra, for your extra dose of crafting. Shopping online with Create and Craft has just got easier with PayPal's Pay in 3 plan. Spread the cost of your basket, whether there is one item or many, with three interest-free payments. Simply choose Pay in 3 at checkout and pay for purchases between £30 and £2,000 over three equal instalments for the next three months. No fees, no interest. Spread the cost of your shopping with PayPal's Pay in 3 plan at Create and Craft. My name's Hannah Roxbury and I am the brand ambassador for Carnation Crafts. Carnation Crafts are A, known for their die sets, but it doesn't stop with just a metal die. What they also bring you is free original colourway vignettes. So that levels the playing field. If you're new to crafting, you can go onto their website, download what we call a vignette, and that allows you and opens up a world of artistry behind the scenes. Everyone on the team is so passionate about what they do and I think that really does come over in all of the designs, all of the products, whether it be a die, whether it be a stamp, whether it be the paper packs as well. Everything is beautifully coordinated. So rather than having to think through the process of how to build a card, that is done for you so you can just enjoy the making of it. If you're new to Carnation Crafts, perhaps you haven't tried this before, all I can say is give it a go. You won't be disappointed. Hi, I'm Anthea. Uh, I'm from Quilting Antics. Quilting Antics started around 2011, 2012, I'm never really sure. At one point we nearly became the cushion company because we churned out so many different cushions. But we'll do bags, we'll do cushions, we'll do book covers, we'll do things for your sewing room. So don't miss the Quilting Antics shows. Hello everybody and a very warm welcome to Crate and Craft. I hope you had a lovely day. If you're seeking refuge from the heat, well hopefully you're inside and we're going to get to keep you company. Now I'm not alone, I'm joined by the lovely Kai. Oh, Hello. you're such you're a sweetheart. You're looking very summery. Oh, well, it's summer. It summer. I am so ready for it's it. <laughs> uh, we had a really busy show earlier on. So, the premise of these yes. shows... We are just offering some stonking deals. Exactly. Basically, what I'm bringing to you today is a merge of myself and Tony Darrow, so stamps by me and Amala. Fantastic deals, but something very special. Mm. Instead of just having to pick one item, or maybe sometimes we do pick a mix where you can buy two or three mm. items, what about buying complete bundles? But instead of just complete... Yeah, collections. And instead what we're doing is buy three bundles... 
and get a further saving. So let, <laughs> I'll explain. Now, it's if you were, so incredible. So we've got two options. Now you can either buy the individual collections by themselves, and a lot of you have gone individually, it's absolutely fine. You're saving £51 if you go individually. But here's the thing. If you were to buy, using the pick and mix, picking three sets, the usual price, the regular retail price, would be two hundred and fifteen pounds and seventeen pence, was it, or sixty-six? It just some change. Oh, let's give them a summer tree. I think oh. we should give them something, you know, much better price than that. Like a good discount. Yeah, like uh, not just a little bit of a discount. Okay, all right. So you would say. What's like, the best you can do? Thirty percent. Oh, uh, it's not good enough. Okay, all right. How about for you, pretty lady? Okay. Um, how about? 50%. Mm, oh, she nice. looks like she's going to walk away. I was, yeah, I don't know. Okay, Not really. Okay. I see that you are. Woo me. A, you Come are on. skilled. You Woo are skilled me. in the art of the haggle. So I'm going to bring out the big guns. Oh, yes. Here we go. 74%. Oh, yes, please. Hello. <laughs> uh, look, that is what you're getting if you go for the pick and mix. It is a 74% saving from the regular silly retail price. It is silly <laughs> o'clock. So, and also you've got the flexi buys. If you're in the club, your first flexi buy is 18.99. That means that you're paying 18.99 per collection. Yeah. And we may, imagine going and getting a collection. You've got three of them. Each one, I apologise, I said 99, it's 18.56. Yeah. Uh, we are going to go through. Yes. Um, we've had a lot of sellouts earlier on, so be warned. Should we start here? Let's start here. Now, this is exceptional. You are getting four most beautiful bespoke stamps, and they're very much sort of um, mm -hmm. garden themed, almost like the vintage seed packets. Yeah. Absolutely incredible. But not oh, only yeah. do you get these beautiful, iconic stamps, and they are you iconic. also get the coordinating dies. So See. then you can cut them out, you can decoupage them, you can multiple layer them. These are beautiful. If we just show you this, allow me to help you yeah. out here, Carly. So having a look at the actual nature of the stamps, and Carly makes a really good point. So we're getting four stamps. I'm showing you the other two yeah. here. This is your petunia and rose. And just while we are on a close-up, I will show you the uh, first two that we just showed. Uh, that's your heliotrope and your hibiscus. Yes. But you are getting your dies to cut out the floral elements, yes. the dies to cut out the stamps as a whole. There's a huge amount there. Uh, and I know that both yourself and Tony were really um, keen to reduce the packaging. Definitely. We want our footprint to come down. So Trust I've just this. taken out the dies. So even though you get two sets of dies that coordinate with the different florals, you also get your outside frames and they're totally different. Again, okay. then you get your decoupage element on top of that. So you will get the floral. I don't know if yep. that's the one for I'm not this. quite sure if it's the exact one. That I may have opened one. the wrong one. But it's okay. But this oh. is the kind of thing you can create. So all I've done oh, here, wow. really, really simply, multiple layers. I've only put one layer of decoupage on there. You could go more if you wanted. Mm -hmm. How simple is that? Create wrapping paper with this. Nice. It would look incredible. How about just on craft card, uh, maybe if you make uh, key rings or yeah. bracelets or earrings. Beautiful as your, your packaging. I know when this is good. Because you've made our director Taz go all cockney. He's like, this is beautiful. <laughs> it's beautiful. <laughs> Suddenly, you know when he likes something, he's like he's yeah. going in EastEnders. I love uh, it. Right, uh, this could be selling out individually. Please do not miss out. The saving is incredible. Uh, ooh, 75% of the stock's gone here. We are hurtling towards that 80% 80 stock, 80 stock territory. Uh, 873 556, your item number. If you do want to go for the bundle where you're choosing your three, and that is one bundle uh, right there, it's at the bottom of your screen. All right, we're going to show you another bundle that might yes, fall into so your basket. Yes, so this is our lumina uh, Laminations bundle. Absolutely this beautiful. Now, this is so easy. If you love all this coloured artwork, mm -hmm. but you're not a fan of putting the effort in, the colouring in, we have your shortcut home. What? So basically, you have the darker area, which is your coloured area. So you use a coloured ink to stamp this. Then on top of that, you the use detail. the detail. 
It's so, so be, simple. So would you use like a, a, a light colour for the background and then maybe a black ink or a grey? Yeah, or what I would tend to do is mix in a bit of green, maybe a little bit of pink in there, mm. and then of course follow the grey works what? a tree. So like do something like that? Yeah, hey. that's exactly what I'd do. Okay, <laughs> that's a demonstration we did earlier on. Let me pop that down. I will show you the die set used to make that. Thank there you so much. There we go. So Hi. there's the stamp set. So basically I just use some distressing just on my main colour panel. Mm -hmm. Then on top, that other panel with a sentiment just popped across. So if you want clean and fresh, tidy, not messy cards, yeah. do you know what I mean? Oh, like, yeah. I love an arty messy card, but some people it's just not, not their elegant. style. Yeah. Be happy, be bright, be you. Now, who would we know that's happy, bright, always positive? Who would? Uh, is that? You, Yay! Carly, it's you. Uh, and then finally, let's show you. This is the third set that you're getting. Yes. Now, one thing I do want to mention is and it's not always about the size but this these are large stamps yes sets. they are absolutely gorgeous you get multiple yeah. sentiments all of the work is done for you so you've got that brilliant iconic stamps ready to go whether it goes on fabric whether it goes on cards and remember everything you make you can sell Nice. Uh, Twenty-two ninety-six is your price, but it gets even better if you are in the club. So do not miss out. Uh, if you are in the club, the price goes down to twenty pounds and sixty-six, saving a whopping fifty-one pounds and thirty pence. That is way better than half price. Uh, now. We're going to move on to one of our favourites in the yes. picnics, and it is one that I would definitely be it's popping into my choice. Absolute beauty. We really like this now. Uh, I was saying, yes. sorry, I'm in trouble. Go on, don't color. worry. But earlier on, <clears> I mentioned, so people I personally struggle sometimes to craft for, my two brother in laws, yep. but also my nephews and nieces, especially teens. the ones entering teens their teens. and tweenies, yeah. yeah. Teens and tweenies. Really, really hard. These are beautiful because you've got that gorgeous script with the affinity circle. Um, Happiness with the You've flock got your of little birds. birds. Really positive, gorgeous words that you can use just on a messy background or a real yeah. arty sort of textured background or standalone or not at all. Add them to something of the other projects as well. Do, do we have any of these? Uh, do you have any of these? To, to stamp, stamp out. yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'd love to see just couple, just to see of them stamped out. See maybe, how crisp yeah? they are. Yeah, of okay. course, yeah. We'll have a little we'll look. That. Now you're not just getting those. Look at these silhouettes. Yes. How cool are they? These are beautiful. So of course you've got the hand heart, which is fabulous. Mm. I mean, look at the motion in these. It's almost you can hear wee <laughs> going down the hill. Absolutely mm. brilliant. You've got adventure. Be awesome. And again, unstoppable. Yeah, nice. Uh, oh, I want to stress, by the way, if you do want to go for the pick and mix. It's got a separate item number at the bottom of your screen. Don't put three individuals into your basket. It won't work that way. What you need to do, you, if you did that, you'd be paying. Yeah, uh, you won't get yeah, the deal. You won't get the deal. So with the pick and mix, you're saving. You're still getting the savings you would on the individual items. But on top of that, you're getting a further thirteen pounds yeah. and fifty-six pence saving on top of the big savings you're getting. Uh, finally, it's we a have lot of saving. Huge savings. <laughs> huge savings. Now this is beautiful as well. Four gorgeous page fillers, if you mm. like. Great iconic sentiments, and of course, home is where the craft stash is. Nice. Look at that. Love that. And it's so true. Exactly. I've been thinking about this. You know, sometimes, I just want to put this into context, the savings that you are yeah. getting. You know, sometimes you, you go out and you might see so a sale item, like in the supermarket, and you say you're saving £2.50 yeah. here, yeah. £5. You think, well, that's really good. If you were to go for the pick and mix at the bottom of your screen for the three collections, yep. £51.30 saving in each is the same price for all of them. So we times that by three, you're looking at £153.90. Yep. On top of that, a further thirteen pounds. Yep. So now we're up to one hundred and sixty-six pounds and some change. A hundred and sixty-six pounds. Yeah. And some change. That would be your saving that you're getting in that collection. Now think about that. You are paying if today eighteen uh, fifty-six. I think it is if you are if you were to do your first flexi yeah, buy in flexi. the club. Uh, we'll put the details on so you can see this. So, 1856. Sorry, your savings here, and obviously you've got your yep. club savings there. But as your first flexi buy, 1856, and your saving is 166 pounds plus. Yeah. 
Uh, it's brilliant, mm. isn't it? Well, maybe you oh, love, you know, the most. projects that myself and Tony do, yeah. and you've thought, oh, I just don't know, and just, I think these prices, for me personally, would sway me to the value of stamps by mm. me. Join our family. We Treat have got yourself. the most beautiful, iconic stamps and dies. There's nothing else like it on the market, and once you experience our quality, you're never going, going back. back. Got to tell you, a lot of options if you are going for the pick and mix are limited stocks. So you're going to, and we had sellouts already. The embossing folders stand out in my mind. Uh, we're going to continue yes. on our journey. We're talking Amala. 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 Look at this. <laughs> We love Imala. Thank you. Uh, so we're going to talk about those eyes. Yes. So this is your top line bundle. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Just up here. So it's the yep. three up here, the three at the bottom, a separate item. Yeah. Now, what you're seeing here, those eyes as an option, have gone individually. You're getting all three sets, and they're limited stock in the pick and mix. These are stock. Stunning. Now, yeah. if you want this, you have to be really, really quick because it's not going to last. Such an opportunity for colour. They're works of art. Thank you. They are absolutely Thank beautiful. Thank you. They're just so different. So, Amala, if you're brand new, um, hello, artisans. Um, absolutely fabulous. It's a, a, a morph of myself and Tony Darrett. And basically, it means ink makes art like art. And that is what we do. We do all the hard work for you, so then you get to be the artist I know you can be like and it's ready to go so yeah. the first line we've got retro girl with that absolutely exquisite sentiment yeah. of course the past is the lesson the present is your gift and the future is your motivation oh now just hold on again let's oh i would like everybody <laughs> to just soak in those words can you read them again okay, that, that's really yeah. important the past is your lesson the present is your gift and the future is your motivation I like that. It's so classy, classy, isn't it? So to me, that's artwork for your home, of that's course. journaling, that's scrapbooking, that's card Whatever making. Whatever you want to create. I mean, what about stamping on fabric? What yeah. about pushing it into air drying clay, create brooches? Everything you create by using a mala, you can sell as well. Mm. So yeah. those eyes, again, oh, we've got that floral bouquet, so she could be keeping a yeah. secret. Could but be. then, of course, oh. you can take them apart and use it in a different style. Yeah. You've got that huge sentiment finding beauty um, in the simple things. Then our final one is our first um, gender neutral stamp that we created, mm -hmm. I Have Arrived. Mm -hmm. So whatever you do, decides it makes you happy. And of course, one o'clock. What time is it? One o'clock. <laughs> Come on, I it's eight o'clock, it's one o'clock. Obviously drink It's Saturday. It's Saturday, come hey. on. Um, I've got to tell you, we're into single figures for this option on the pick and mix. You have to be quick here because they are going to go uh, single figures. Uh, right now, we're going to have a look at your so, next yes, set. our second this bundle from Avala. This is Changes. So we've got that beautiful, gorgeous uh, bouquet, if you like, of absolutely fabulous. They could mm -hmm. be stargazer lilies. And of course, you've got fabulous art sort of um, sort of wiggle room because you can play with your, your reflections, your light mm -hmm. on the water in there. You've got two beautiful sentiments as well. Then we move over to grrr, which is fabulous, with that beautiful, huge sentiment again. And then the final one is the Tree of Life. And I'm going to be adding stunning. that into one of the demos to show I'm you. I'm so pleased you said that, because I was actually going to it's ask beauty, you. It's isn't could. it? Now, how well has that been designed? If we just have a look at the Tree of Life, just over here, I'd like to get a good look at that, because the design work is Stunning original design work um, from yourself, Carly, and I know you put yep. a lot of thought into that. So just looking here because this is meant to represent all those aspects of life. It's, it's life, yeah. So we've got oh, the home nice. part. We've got obviously recreation when we go out, when we're out in the forest. When we've got work, or it could be school, or it could be new job. It could be the future and the past. It's mm. just got so much going on. Yeah. Works absolutely exquisite in journaling. Great design, and it's also very snippable too. Oh, you could just take uh, take elements, fussy of cut those out. Uh, twenty six, uh, twenty two, sorry, ninety six is your price, but it goes down to twenty ninety nine if you are in the club. I've seen this look here before. You see that tiger? If it's it's normally when Bernie, our floor manager, oh, right. hears that someone's brought in chockies or cake. Oh yeah. You see it all of a sudden. Her eyes just peeping around <laughs> the flowers here. Did someone say cake? <laughs> uh, all right, there we go. If you do want to get hold of this set, uh, 962-859, the item number. Oh, wait, is there, is there cake in production? 
How did I not? How did I not hear about this? I don't know. I'm always the last to hear about when food gets brought oh, in. Oh, that's not fair. I know, eh? Hey? Uh, I need to take a leaf out of Bernie's book and start peeping more. Uh, okay, we're gonna <laughs> we're gonna move on. We've got some we got some dyes now. So we talked yes. about stamps. We're onto our dyes. This is limited stock, though, and it is not going to last. Beautifully designed. It's card. so different, it's so isn't clever. it? Clever. Tell yeah. us the concept. Okay, so the concept is in each pack you get four different mm -hmm. dies. You get two gorgeous frames. Now every single one of the packs is different for the frame, so you can see you've got that slightly different edge so each one on different both of the effects. So every single um, die comes with a different one. Then you get your plates that go inside. So I'm just going to show you two, for instance. So you get that. Die cut quality, absolutely beautiful. But then also what you get is the embossing. So it cuts certain parts, but it also embosses others. Now here's one that I done quickly earlier, and if I tilt it forward, Let me help you, yeah. you can see. Yeah. It's brilliant, isn't it? So some people don't believe in heroes. Yep. What's the next bit? If I see that there, can we see that? It's See, what it is, is you can see yeah. the, the piece of the words. So basically, if I tilt it forward, the heroes is more cut out because uh -huh. it actually is cut through the, rather than the embossing. Well, we've got so the there we go. If, so I if, tilt think, it. Look at, if we look at the packaging, it shows it. Yeah. So then you can use your inks over the top. Absolutely beautiful. If you've got yeah. a typewriter stamp or a typewriter die, have it feeding out. So what it does is it embosses one part, yeah. but then it actually cuts out right. on the other piece. Now, um, you are getting two design plates on each one, and there's Hero standing out on the packaging uh, with it. That's the one not featured on the front of the factory. Yeah. You will get two of the design plates, and you also get the frames in there as well. So uh, what you're getting, if you think about this, and again, it's uh, stamps by me and Carly. What they, you, I know you put a lot of emphasis on being more environmentally of friendly. Of course, exactly. Yeah. So rather than having lots and lots of plastic sheets, we try to condense everything into our cardboard packaging. Mm -hmm. So one, it's easy mm -hmm. to find. It's really simple to be able to um, organise your library of your diet very very simple and of course you get their mats and layers so we're included in this you're gonna it? get of course you get you're gonna get six beautiful panels with the word yeah. in then also you're gonna get six decorative panels to go around the edge so this is gonna be a demonstration that we've got coming up uh, a little bit later in the show but do you see how the mother takes yeah. on the prominence and, and especially if you put a different colour behind it it yeah. really makes it pop Oh, I like that. Okay, we get, that is going to be a demonstration, so stay tuned. I'll, I'll pop it you back. Pop I'll pop it back. back. I took it. Uh, <laughs> 414 671, your item number. Now, next. Oh, it's just sold out it's individually. Gone. But the good news is it's still part of the pick Ooh. and mix. So tell us about this Okay, one. now this, this is a gorgeous collection. If you love florals but you love that sort of fretwork, let me show you what you are getting. So this top one, for instance, you can tell by uh, the side we have all of our instructions on there. There are QR cards as well. If you want to go onto the website, you get your mats and then you get your beautiful layers of gorgeous ornate florals. That's so pretty. Isn't it fabulous? Now, an option to paper piece, you can just have the line exactly. art if you want. Or like the card that I created earlier, just use it as the backing so it just really pops the colours that you're using that on the other pretty. side. It's oh, that's fab, really isn't nice. it? Yeah, we like that. And then I've cut the heart out as well. That's mm -hmm. one of the um, others that are in this collection. Cut the, ha cut cut the, the heart, heart out. I feel like <laughs> shot of my heart. Then. Literally. Um, yeah. And then, of course, you've got your sentiments included in that as well. So whether you want to paper piece this. And we were saying earlier, if you can really multiple layer it, if you can cut it like 250 GSM, cut five of them, absolutely gorgeous. Make it really thick, add ribbon to it, it turns into a brooch. You could even put um, acid the tape behind it, colour it with your alcohol markers, stained glass windows. Oh, that would be pretty. Pretty. And, do you know what the lover, uh, love, uh, love us? <laughs> <laughs> I love us too. <laughs> it's happened, yes. But, uh, you can... <laughs> <laughs> you can snip it. You can snip it. That just have the love or the us in there. That's not easy to say on TV. Uh, Eight two zero six zero four. Your item number. The only way to get hold of this is part of our pick and mix. But the good news is the pick and mix is the best 
possible value to get yeah. hold of the collections because you're getting all the individual savings that you would uh, with if you just went for one of the collections but yeah. on top of that you're saving a further 13 pounds and 56 pence it's incredible if you think uh, earlier I mean we was talking about my Amala stamps yeah. each individual sort of RAP um, <coughs> you know the recommended retail price that I'm supposed to sell my Amala stamps is 17.99 a piece well, so you right are now. saving and amazing. Mm, you really are. Uh, well, do you know, if you went for, we were talking about the pick and mix at full price, £215.88. Oh, no thanks. £215.88. But I want to stress. So, that could I would spend £258 worth on this product and not tell anyone and then just have more? We have to be good. Why not? Why not? Yeah. Uh, problem is, though, we're starting to sell out very Okay, fair enough. Uh, let's move on. But you know, just looking at that though, 1856 yeah. today, first flexi buy. That's phenomenal. But the value of product that you're getting, regular yeah. retail price, is over 200 pounds yeah. or 215 pounds. Now, uh, this last option, it is uh, another collection only available as part of our pick and mix, but it is beautiful. It is beautiful. It's a collection of gorgeous florals. Absolute stunning sentiments. So whether you're paper piecing, whether you're creating something a bit different like I've done with the monochrome background. Also, you can really easily cut and colour. I was saying earlier, you've got plenty of room if you want it in the florals and the basket, for instance. Do Zentangle, that would Ooh, work really well. Cheeky. Again, stamping on fabric. Um, pop it into clay, so much you can do with this, it's so versatile. With any florals, they are timeless, they are absolutely bespoke and timeless, and you can create as much as you like and sell. This is a opportunity to build up your Stamps by Me Definitely. and Amala collection at such a ridiculously good price. Yeah. Um, with 1856 per collection, you're looking at just over six pounds yeah. per stamp or die set. I mean, what you could do is ring your crafty friends, mm -hmm. maybe pop three sets, and then what you could do is have one bit each. Could it? You could just split it down and share. Well, I mean, look, let's again go back to that point. Look at the size and quality of these stamps. I'll put my hand in shot just to give you a sense of scale. Uh, and I I've got big hands, so you can see that. <laughs> that is, look, Sorry. I tell you why I say that is because if I had really little hands, that doesn't show anything. Uh, uh, these could be A6, but I don't. Uh, they're large A6. Say three. I've got I got sauce pad hands. No, um, but what you're getting in here is it's not, they're not A3, they're A5. Sorry. I mean, no, the only person who's got sauce pad hands is our tag. Um, <laughs> But if you want to get hold of these, six pounds per stamp or yeah. per die. It's phenomenal. Amazing. You, I amazing. mean, to be honest, even if you see, you know, maybe you'd get one stamp on sale that would be yeah. an absolute absolute cracker you'd be like ringing all your friends telling them to buy them get down there it's super super cheap just that one stamp but having this amount of beautiful products and fill you, your boots my friends you imagine that arriving on your doorstep now i want to stress if you want to take advantage of the pick and mix do not put three individual collections in your basket it will not work what you need to do is use this item number eight two zero six zero four. yep uh, that is uh that is all the options you scroll through and then you pick so you need to pick three here and let's put it to the test we've got a lovely producer Laura Laura what are you popping in your basket she's going for that one she okay. wants that one Taz our big friendly giant director what are you going for buddy he's, uh, he's having a look do you know what's interesting the, there's less to choose from now than there was last, uh, yeah. last hour uh, and uh, we'll let Bernie Bernie what are you going for our form manager she wants the true love. She's feeling in a romantic oh. mood. Okay, there we go. Uh, a bit odd that she was looking at me when she said that. It was a bit, <laughs> bit, there we go. I thought we had a moment there, Bernie. Uh, so you pick three, and then you just add it to your basket. That's it. That's how the pick and mix works. You need to pick from that item number I showed you. Do not put three individuals into your basket. Uh, and if you sign in as part of the club, the price gets even better. And of course, you can spread the costs 
as well. Uh, right, if you do have any questions for us, we'd love to hear from you, or you just want to say hello, it is Saturday night. Come on, get in touch. Let's have a giggle. Studio at cranecraft.com. What are we going to do? Right, okay. First of all, what I want to do is I quickly want to show you how to cut these phenomenal dies. So this is the one um, with mother on it. So you've got that beautiful, absolutely gorgeous one. So what you can do is you can cut and, of course, um, do it at the same time in box, but I always prefer to just do it twice okay. because I, I'm a bit of a stickler. I, I want it to be crisp and perfect, so I just prefer to do it yeah, twice. You, yeah. you know, you could run it through once and be happy with it, but I always do that. So, of course, you get your decorative frames that come with it, which is absolutely perfect. And then what I tend to do is you can see that it's cut already, and it has actually embossed. If I lift this out, hold on, there we go. You can see it has already but then I could emboss slightly more if I okay, wanted no, on there. See, that, see? Yeah. It, is a it is okay, yeah. but it's not enough. So I just want to give it a little tad more. In. Of course, just slot it back in, take your magnet mat away, and then I'm just going to pop your my shin, my embossing over the top, like so. Okay. Then I'm just going to run it through. So once you've done that point, then you can take all the rest of your layers. So I've already pre-cut this one, okay. ready to go. Here we go, let's just stop this. And we're gonna do some ink work on here, plus also I'm gonna add in that beautiful tree. Because right. I know you're desperate to see Love it. Love the tree, I really do like it. It's so iconic, yeah. isn't it? So okay. you can see oh, here. That's, look, that's embossed like a dream. Just by adding that little bit extra. There we go. Look, oh, at, look that. at that. Isn't that lush? And then, of course, what you can do is just mm -hmm. add ink over the top of that to bring that to the foreground. Now, don't forget, you do get multiple frames. So, what I've done here already is I've Such got... Such nice words for a Mother's Day, a Mother's Day <laughs> yeah, card exactly. or a birthday. So, exactly. you've got Mother running down, and then the M's used to say amazing. Yep. The O's loving, strong, happy, selfless, it's brilliant, graceful. Isn't it? I think that sums up. And then you've got that beautiful embossed frame around there. Of course. Of course, oh, lovely. Lovely words. For so I'm just going to add onto my card now. I've already done my multiple layers. Mm -hmm. So I'm just going to pick this up now and I'm going to grab some white ink, she says. Oh, I'm, I'm having white ink. I'm going to go for some white ink. Have yeah. you, did you find those phone pads? I did. And where guess were where they, they were? Where they were, were they? stuck to the back of my card. Wow. Yeah, can you believe that? We were doing a show earlier on. It, it's, it happens and we, we, to we, me all the time. We used the phone pads and then we came back to them and we just. The love of money. He was like, me. I've seen them. But I saw you put I them I told there. you, there's a fairy that follows me. It was me stuck on the back of the car. Yeah. That That's hides hilarious. my stuff. She does it all the time. That is hilarious. It's just so, <laughs> I <laughs> know. So I'm just going over with a little bit of white ink. Now, if you want to incorporate Imala into a uh, vellum work, stamp it with white. It looks beautiful, nice. absolutely it's stunning. So this really is just gonna be a taper on the side that I will just use for balance. So I'm just gonna bring it over, pop mm -hmm. it down. Now, if you do struggle with upper body strength, I suggest you use a pressure point, which is almost like the top of a candle. Yeah. Have you seen them, the jars that go on the <laughs> yeah, candle? Yeah. Um, they work really well, or a brayer. Oh, okay. Yeah. I thought you, for some reason, sure. I was laughing. I thought if you struggle with alpha body strength, if you do some press ups, yeah, no. I don't know where you're going to go with that. I'm not doing <laughs> press ups, I'm not for no one. I thought you were giving our fitness advice for a second. That's it. If all I do is struggle eat with sugar. legs, do some squats. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that is so funny. No, but you're absolutely right. I have yeah. seen that. Just putting some weight Yeah, just use a pressure yeah. point. So yeah. there we go. Quickly stamped. Really, really easy there. I've already stamped that gorgeous oh, tree of life. And I'm just going to heat set that quickly before I add more layers. So on top of this, I've already decided. Oh, look at this. I'm multitasking now. I do this all the time. I, I start feel, doing other things. I feel like I, I should be helping. Oh, don't be I'm just here for moral support. Don't, yeah, just, just smile. Do it. You just look pretty. It's oh, fine. Apparently, I'm failing at that as well. Oh, don't be tough. So, <laughs> what I've done is when you cut this out, if you cut the frame mm. at the same time, then you get these beautiful apertures. Nice. And what I'm going to do with these is something that I love to do, mm. which is I'm going to create 
a really pretty background. So I'm going to pick up my frames. I'm just going to tap them into some wet glue. The reason why I do that is because I don't want the splurge when I, you know. No one likes the splurge. No, it's not pretty, is it? Mm -hmm. Especially if you haven't got something to be able to get it off. Yeah. So I'm just going to add these. This is nice. Just on the top. I've gone for some really nice coordinating um, colours. So I'm just adding them frames from the Hero Bundle. So, so absolutely fabulous. I'm just going to add that one. Now, Hero like Bundle, so. you can get that as part of our Pick and Mix, which is extremely busy. If you do want to get it um, individually, we put the details at the bottom of your screen, but I've got to tell you it is limited stock. And remember, if you're in the club, the price goes down to £20.66. So, now what I'm going to do is I'm just going to start adding some colour to this. You've got that beautiful embossing. I'm just going straight over and just pulling that colour over. And it just literally brings it to life. I'm just going to move into my next colour. So I've got a slightly a bit more orangey and when, just... when was your eureka moment oh. when did you get your eureka well i've had my eureka quite a while now oh. um i think i've probably had my eureka f six years nice. yeah okay the reason why i say that is a lot of viewers are having their own eureka moment right are now they? Uh, they are oh that excites me we have got the eureka now the eureka it is so much more than a stamping yeah. platform. It is a total creative station. It's an station. art station. It is it an really art station. Is. So designed to help not only stamping, we can use our watercolours in there, create a watercolour palette. We can yep. use it for beading. We can emboss. You've also got um, your card blanks. You can score your card blanks and your envelopes there as well. So, it's brilliant, so much isn't it? Flower making oh, with the everything. Amount. I love my Eureka. I could not be without it. Well, that's, can I just hold that up and of show? Of course. That's just a little bit of light blending. Hey. Nothing massive. Now look at that. Isn't that pretty? <laughs> so there you've got the mother running through there and then you've got those beautiful embossed self. Mothers are selfless. Oh, totally. Yeah, a mother, totally. Mothers, can't think mothers do if there's, there's only a couple of sausages left. Oh, they'll yeah. Give it to the kids. Of course they will. They'll go hungry. Yeah. It's life is life, yeah. yeah. I mean, my seven-year-old, I bet, I can't remember last time I got a hooked dinner. Oh. <laughs> so here you go. <laughs> he's hilarious. They do eat a lot. Honestly, he's just so busy. I mean, we're on school holidays at the moment, and I was just uh, saying earlier, literally, I'm doing the first five things he's asked me, and he's still asking me to do another five things. Bless. And I'm like, Good give night. me a minute, give We've me a minute. have got all that to look forward to. Yeah. I, I've, I've discovered that I have to pay my daddy tax now. Oh, when I, okay. When I sit down to eat anything, yeah. this little head... Yeah, I mean, it doesn't even saunter up to me. I see this head sprint to me, and then <laughs> Archie Yo says up. So yeah, he wants to sit on my knee, and then he wants what you've got. He wants to eat. Of course he does. Yeah. Well, the best thing was when my son started school, and I had to uh -huh. buy him a magazine every Friday as wages, because oh. he was like, I don't get wages. So I want a magazine. Yeah, so now I have to buy him a magazine every Friday, and it's his wages for oh. going to school. <laughs> that's the that's, uh, that's wages. That's He's five. I was like, what? Now something's wrong here because he gets the same wages as me. Oh, do you get the, do you get the Crane the Croft, I get the Crane Croft magazine. <laughs> that's my wage quarterly. Brilliant, brilliant. <laughs> so now what I'm doing is I've already stamped these florals out. Now these are from Guru. Yeah. Um, these are just the flower element, not using the um, tiger at all. But there oh, we go. That is very pretty thank you now that really is pretty and showing actually you raised a really good point here everything on the counter works together it's this mixable. way if you do get a collection exactly can we, can we just take a moment to consider something now we've got some beautiful collections here let's just say you did go for the pick and mix yeah that means that you're going to have three collections winging the way to you just imagine when you hear that knock on your yes. door your local postie hands you that massive package full yeah. of goodies and then you get to play with them. I mean, the of hard course. part is which do you start with first? Exactly. Now, you may be thinking, where do I find inspiration for this? Check yeah. us out on social media. We've got an excellent group. Um, absolutely brilliant. Um, mm -hmm. There is so many step-by-step -step videos. Oh. Myself has my own YouTube and we've got the QR codes. This is something, well. actually, we, we haven't talked uh, yeah. much about the QR codes, but it's worth mentioning. So on all the packaging... 
There is a QR code. So I'll show you the beautiful packaging. This is one of our, yeah. they're on all of them. And it's all completely recyclable. Yeah. The reason we put these in as well is not just so we can hang them up when we're selling them, yeah. but also you can put a scrapbooker's ring and then you can keep oh, your bundles yeah. together, things like that. It just works. That is your magic code. So when you scan that code, it will instantly direct you to YouTube videos yeah. demonstrating the collection. But it's it's a smart code in the sense yeah. that when more videos are ad added, every time you scan this, you're going to discover more and more videos. Of course videos. you will. Exactly. It's brilliant. Yeah. So we will hold your hand each step of the way. We'll help you with inspiration and creation, and you will love mm -hmm. them, honestly. Quick question for you, Carly. Yes, now I'm my thinking, I'm, I'm getting creative. Ooh. Have a look at this collection and just go with me on this. Would you think, I mean, I, I see myself using a lot of greens uh, with these beautiful yes. stamps. Green a good colour choice? Of course. Yeah. But mm -hmm. what about sort of vintage creams? What about lilacs? No, Maybe no, no. you could freshen it I, up. I'm just thinking green. Just I wouldn't green. use anything else. Okay. I'll tell you why. Because we've just gone green on the screen, Yay! everybody. Limited stock uh, or individually. That would <laughs> imagine we've just gone cream on the screen doesn't have the same thing. It name. doesn't. Cream <laughs> <laughs> Just heard it. Just <laughs> take them words, Just put them back it, in your mouth. That's how you make it onto the pooper <laughs> reel. Uh, so there we go. If you do want to go for this collection, 873-556 is your item number there. Oh. Oh, I'm blaming you on that one, Carly. You're oh, no. About that. It's usually uh, me no. that says something silly. Uh, well, you can. Uh, oh, it's also limited on the pick and mix as well. Uh, so there we go. Green on the screen. And I will never mention another colour again. Uh, we have got other items coming as well. Shall we, uh, shall we head down the counter? Oh, shall we? Let's yeah. go and have a little look. Yeah. Oh, so, actually, we're doing, we're doing still. Oh, okay. okay. Uh, now, uh, yeah, we want to stick with you, Carly. Okay. Right. okay. So, have a look here. This is another collection. This is our laminations. Uh, oh, I love this. You're getting all the best, the magic, and there for you. Really, really beautiful stamps. And with this collection, what's, well, what makes this stand out is you've got your um, solid stamps, which create the sort of effectively your mat and then your detail stamp over, so they are layering stamps. Twenty-two ninety-six is your price, but you have got a club price on there. One four three three nine nine your item number. Uh, unstoppable happiness and craft stash. Love this collection, and I said it in the previous hour, and I stand by this. This would be my first collection that I'd put into my basket, and I'm not it's alone beautiful. actually. A lot of you, it's one of the most popular collections this hour. Uh, 22.96 if you do want to go for this. If you're in the club, it goes down to 20.66, saving 51.30. Remember, you're getting your silhouettes in there, beautiful uh, characters with the silhouettes. You're also getting the sentiments, which are stunning as well. 678561, your item number. Uh, now, let's have a look at your changes, your guru and your tree of life. So this is Amala. Oh, and we love Amala here. 962 uh, 859, your item number. Same savings if you're in the club as all the other collections. So saving goes up to £51.30. And then we've got our Heroes Special and a hug for your... A hug for your hand. Yeah. Oh. That's nice, the hug for your hands. Uh, so there we go. Uh, if you do want to get a hold of that, 414-671, your item number. But we are limited stock. I like a hug for your hand. Yeah. So holding a card is like a hug for your hand. Yeah. Uh, there, there was more. Uh, by the way, we are limited in the pick and mix for that as well. So please don't miss out. Whoa, just one more to show you. I apologise, we came back too quick. Uh, this is your die set. Um, we just looked at this, so you get those plates uh, in there, that's with the mother we were just looking at. Yep. Uh, so you're getting your little love, your happy thoughts, and you'll be different. Uh, 643570. Uh, and that's the last one I'm going to show you is only available as part of the pick and mix, as is uh, the, uh, well, as, a lot, as are a lot of them. So there we go. We've got Imala here as well, uh, just showing you that. Okay. Okay, so I'm going to show you how to use the um, beautiful Layer. laminations, okay. the layered colour. Yeah. So I'm going to show you really simply how this works. Like I said before, you take your, um, on your packaging, you'll have more black and they're the bits that are the coloured parts that we use in okay. and then these will be your decorative detail, detail. Mm -hmm. so I've taken my main piece I'm just gonna pick this up so you got your eyes ink I sure have I love my eyes yeah. ink I don't know why I start singing I, I sing these I don't know it just happens you, I have we, no control have you ever have you ever done any musicals oh yeah yeah oh. I love a musical I do a lot of ballet as well are you 
you're a triple threat. <laughs> Presenter, actor. Yeah, it's it's true. It's beautiful. I love a Dancer, bit of ballet. Yeah, there you go. Yes, absolutely fabulous. So I'm just adding a sort of mixture of colours. So I've gone for a little bit of tiny blue and now just on the edges. Oh, just a hint of colour. You know Laura, our yes. producer, is an actor. Oh, I know. I right, know. And currently, because you were, and I'm not joking around here, she really is. She was in Elf. She was in Elf. Uh, in Shrek. And um, you're in something, I forget the name now. What's the one you're. It's a, it's a mouthful. It's the 21st annual Putnam Spelling Bee. Oh, 25th. Wow. Annual County Putney Spelling Bee. <laughs> Got She's in the spelling bee. She's in the spelling bee. How exciting. When is that actually going to be out? When, when can we go and see it? It's end of September, beginning How of October. How exciting. Look, if you're in the. The Peterborough area, have a look. So now I'm going to take my decorative, and the best way to do it is look at it and see where your largest floral is. Then you simply turn it till it fits. It's that easy. Nice. So then we'll pick this up now. And like I said earlier, I really like using grey on this. I just find that using the black can sometimes be a mm -hmm. bit harsh. I'll use black for my sentiment, but not for my detail. Yeah. So I'm going on with morning mist. Oh, nice. I do love a bit of morning mist. Yeah. Just nice tap round. Really beautiful. And of course, this could be Christmas. Think about this could be poinsettias. So you can really change it up and mix it up. Super versatile. So now I'm coming straight back down. Just add in that pressure over the top. Everyone's saying the show's yeah, going fast. It's going quite. It is, it's isn't it? It's having fun. Yeah. Don't tell anyone. I don't know. Time flies when you are. We're not having fun, yeah. really. We're at work. Oh, now that's pretty. Look at that. How yes. lush is that? So now on top, I'm just going to grab my black ink now. Very simple. Mm -hmm. Go back in. <laughs> Fabulous. So now we shall just fill that piece. And then we are done. So, of course, think about it. You could decoupage these, couldn't yeah. you? Yeah, yeah, you could yeah. really build this up. But oh, look at that. Pretty. Isn't it pretty? I'm just, yep, I'm happy yeah. with that. There we go. So, I mean, look at this. <laughs> look at that as a finished inspiration. and so quick and easy to do. But it looks incredibly effective. Doesn't it? And think about all the different colours you can use. I mean, this could very easily be a continuation stamp where you can create backgrounds mm. from it. Absolutely gorgeous. Could you do me a favour? Of course I could. You know we were talking about these things. Oh, should we stamp some of those? Few, so I'd love to see a couple of those. Of course we can. No worries. Now, this is from our You're Awesome uh, collection. Yeah, so I'm actually, what I'm going to do is I'm going to quickly put this together with that. Okay. Because uh, we're doing okay for time. Um, I'm going to... I'm going to emphasize. Oh, you are amazing. Sorry, I said that you were awesome. Yeah. So, what I've done is I've already done some pre stamp mm -hmm. work using that beautiful layering floral stamp, layering said, yeah. stamp just on an 8x8 eight eight card. I've gone for soft pink and grey just so it sits really pretty. And then, what I'm going to do is I'm going to slightly Ooh, tilt it like so, but then we're going to pull this down and this mm -hmm. is going to go over the top. So what we're going to do now is I'm just going to use that to make sure I'm in the right position. I'll just pop that, sorry, okay, sorry. pop that to the side to make sure I've got overhang at the top and the bottom. Nice and simple. And then I will remove that from the middle. Now I'm going to take my centimeters. Now these are beautiful. So I'm just going to grab my thankful, very simply, and I'm going to wipe, uh, shall I wipe? No, I think I'll go for peach and pink, actually. Okay. This is what happens, I change my mind as I go along. I, uh, every crafter does it. <laughs> this is what us crafters do. Yeah. It's not just being a woman. No. <laughs> no. Being a crafter, all crafters do it. We all do it. So I'm going to go yeah. for a little bit of copper, I oh, think. Nice. I think that will go yeah. really well with that. I'm also just going to grab my embossing. Here we go. Okay. See, I, I absolutely always bring everything I could possibly mm. need, and then I can't find anything once I'm, I've got it here. <laughs> this is just my hidden. <laughs> Some fairies, I told you. Cheeky fairies. Honestly, taking all my things, especially my phone pads. <laughs> <laughs> I reckon you put them there. 
I was literally, I was like, I can't wait, throw me under the bus when I was helping you take <laughs> the phone pads off. Yeah. I'm joking. So I'm using Wow Embossing. Absolutely gorgeous. Straight onto that lovely thick vellum. I'll lift that off. Nice. Go straight into my messy bowl. Here we go. Mm -hmm. Lovely. Then I will grab my bronze. Look how glitzy this is. Yeah, oh, it's that. so spangly. It's beautiful. So then, of course, just make sure you give it a little, a flick. little flick to make sure that's off. Can you pull this back in, please? Oh, yes, please. Oh, I could do it here at home. <laughs> How handy. So, no, my son, that's right, they're asking me if my son helps. Not really, no. He likes hiding things, especially when I do Facebook Lives. He finds it hilarious. <laughs> Honestly, he such really does. Such a, a little boy thing to do. Oh, don't. Yesterday, he was out the front in his paddling pool and we had some friends over. Mm -hmm. And um, my son's like me, absolutely loves Parma Violets. And yeah. they've started doing them. Obviously, other sweets are available. But um, he absolutely loves the lollies. Mm -hmm. So um, I got, got him some lollies and one dropped on the floor. And I heard him oh. asking his friend daring him to lick the lolly that had been floor. on the floor. That is a boy thing to do. I was like that, what are you doing? I know, but it is, it's soul destroying and to And, that and do you know what he said? Floor. Three second rule. Three second rule. That's what he told three second me. Rule. Is that, do kids still do it? I don't, I don't three second know. Rule. I was like, what do I say to that? Three second rule. <laughs> do you know well, three yeah. second rule. So now nice. I'm just going to pop this over, making sure I've got that top piece oh. and that bottom nice. to really do a simple overlay and of mm -hmm. course just use your tape runner because none of it's going to be seen mm -hmm. my uh, my cutie dad story yeah is my wife sent, sent me a, a video of our son oh I was, beautiful I'm working late at the moment so she sent me a bit he hadn't gone to bed yeah and the video she sent me and I kid you not, was my son at the door, our front door, okay. in his nappy, yeah. with sunglasses on and his shoes, tried to open the door. My wife is saying to him, by my, bear in mind that he should be in bed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So where are you going? And he said, I want to go to the park. <laughs> oh. Archer, you can't go to the park now. It's, it's so hard. hard for them to realise, isn't it? Sunglasses, yeah, nappy, ready. trying to reach for the door. Well, it's like my son, literally, the other day, run out in his pants in yeah. the garden. He's got um, his skateboarder's helmet on that's got a full Mohican. He's got loads of stuff on, on his arms and toys and everything, telling me it's his armour. This is good luck. <laughs> This is a good He's free. Yeah, He's free. <laughs> so here we go. Just using them iconic sentiments and then of course that fabulous, beautiful oh, floral that is work. Stunning. And just have a look at that sentiment. I mean they are works of art in their own right. I'm just tilting it so you can see it. Isn't that beautiful? Okay, we're gonna be really quick and just show you uh the pick and mix. Sorry. <laughs> Thank you. Which way is it? Oh, is that one? <laughs> Sorry, Carly. Uh, we should give a quick reminder of the pick and mix. So this is what you can be popping into your basket. Remember, with the pick and mix, please don't put three individual items uh, into your basket. Don't do that. Don't put because it, it won't work. You need to use the item number. Of course, you can go for the collections individually, but if you do want to take advantage of the further savings in the pick and mix, use the item number eight two zero six zero four. So and then just add. Three collections, not three stamps, not three dies, three collections. So depending on your choices, you could be, uh, I'm sorry, the embossing folders, they gown. Uh, but you could... It's gone. It's gone. You could get like <laughs> nine stamps uh, sets or you could get uh, die sets with stamps. You know, the choices are endless. Have a little look. Well, I say endless. There are a lot of choices. Yeah, there is a lot of yeah, choices. There is an end, but there are a lot. <laughs> <laughs> so what are we going to do? Okay, we're going to do one. some triple layer stamping. Triple layer yeah. stamping? Yeah. Just before yes. we do this, do you want to see a picture? Oh, I'd yeah. love to. So Jo sent in what she's been making. Let's have a little look. And we love it when you do email in. Oh, I oh. love them. Hello. Oh, look at that's, that. Jo, that's stunning. amazing. How pretty is that? That is super Joe, you've made my day because when we do say please email and send pictures, we genuinely mean it. So yeah. I love it uh, when we get sent stuff. Thank you so much, Joe. And I 
really think that is stunning. It's very, beautiful. Very nice, yeah. Well done. Really good job. Mm -hmm. So what I'm going to do is I've taken, now I've already got my mats and layers, so this is just a backing piece. And then I've also taken two of them beautiful frame cuts. Very nice from the Heroes those, Bundle. Yeah. You like those frames, I do, you? I do indeed. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to slightly offset them Got slightly. a little bit of a postage feel to them. Hasn't it? Like exactly. So I'm just going to grab a tiny bit of low tack, or I'll mm -hmm. just use a tiny bit of tape runner that's repositionable. Mm -hmm just to keep them in to position just for a you. second. So you can see that I'm slightly offsetting them, but it will become one eventually. Mm. On top of this, I'm stamping changes. I mean, how lovely is that as a stamp? Oh, it's so lush. I mean, whether it's weddings, whether it's birthdays, I mean, this is a great memory card as well. You could mm -hmm. make the most beautiful, um, um, uh, Oh, it's totally gone out of my mind. Um, cards for people that are unwell, things yeah, like that. Yeah. Sympathy just cards. Sympathy. That's the word. <laughs> See, I've got all these happy words. I forget yeah, all the sad right, words. Okay. Hopefully you don't. Yeah. Oh, I know. So I'm just going straight over. Now this stamp, this changes, works exquisitely in rose gold. It mm. just sings. It really does. But I'm just going to show you quickly on the black. Now, because I'm doing triple layers, I've got my base card, I've got two different layers. Every single layer has a lip as you pop it on. So what you need to do is make sure you apply enough pressure to be able to go over them because otherwise you won't get the layering technique. So I'm just pushing this down as I go over. <laughs> They're making you giggle. They're making you giggle. Yeah, okay. Really, really simple. Mm -hmm. So you just push it straight down. Obviously the beauty of the Eureka means that you can go straight back in oh, if you that's want. Nice. But I'm just gonna pull this away. I'm slightly just gonna heat set this really, yeah. really quickly because I don't want anything to smudge. Yeah. But I still want to keep it in the position. Uh -huh. So now I will show you how I will place this together. So I'll just take this away and pop that over there. And sorry, yeah, okay. landed on you. Okay. So now I've got my white base card, really, really simple. Um, at the top here, I'm just going to add a silver mat mm -hmm. with a decorative colour mat as well. Pretty. Really, really easy. So that this will be the map oh, for nice. my first layer. What made you turn it on the side there? Oh, because I, d I didn't like a darker to light. I prefer yeah. it that way. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, it's just yeah, a bit just different. A peek into your mind. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So now I'm just going to add this one here. Uh -huh. Then I'm going to take my next layers of decorative card. Uh -huh. Really, really simple. You're just going to build up them frames. And of course, everything mm. matches perfectly. This is interesting. Is it a bit different? Yeah, I like this. It's nice to do something different. Mm. Sometimes we need to just think outside the box, I think. Yeah. So now I've got my mat and layer taken care of there. So this one will go here. So basically now you're putting it back together. Mm. It's like a mosaic. With the mats. Or tiling. Yeah, exactly. So I'm just fitting that into the right position there. Then this one will go perfectly in there. Then mm. what I've done is I'm going to stamp a sentiment on the bottom of that actually. Oh, is is that I've already pre This is called stamp, triple stamping. Triple stamp layering, yeah. yeah. Stamp really, layer. really simple. So I'm just or triple layer stamping. <laughs> Sorry? Triple layer stamping. Triple layer stamping, yeah. And it's brilliant, it's so much fun. If you've not tried it, absolutely exquisite with scenes. It looks lush. Okay. So, um, you know, really, if you are doing this type of stamping technique, then you do need a Eureka. Yeah. Because you need the magnets, you need the size, you need everything to be in the right place. Nice. So I'm just going to add that at the bottom there. Mm -hmm. Pick that up. That's a fine glare. I love this fave because, like I said earlier, it's almost like a heart pattern, yeah. you know, like the beep beep. beep. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Really, really pretty. Got a strong signal. Uh, yeah, thank goodness. <laughs> so now you can either um, pop it on with wet glue, but then what I tend to do is I just give it a little squidge, a tiny bit of book binding glue. Nice. And then we're just going to find it's that one, that one, and we're just going to add these back into position.
Oh, this is nice. It's that easy. See how simple it is. This is a great inspiration, Carly. It doesn't have to be tricky to be beautiful. Oh, that would be a good sentiment. <laughs> yeah. You know, you need to add that into Do I need line. to add that you, in? Remember that one. It doesn't need to be tricky to be beautiful. It doesn't. It really doesn't. And sometimes the most simplest of projects yeah. look so phenomenal. Well, they they really do. Actually, there's another sentiment there. You could bash them out this hour. <laughs> So what you can do as well, if you don't want to decoupage them exactly on, a great way, because I've slightly coloured these, is to pop them into the places where we previously had unstamped flowers. So there we go. How quick and simple and unique is that? Oh, how pretty. Carly, that is stunning. <laughs> Now, uh, I just want to show you some finished samples that I've just picked up because... Some bits I've been making. Some bits you've been making. Yeah. Like, for instance, have a look at this. Uh, yeah. We'll show what we were making, actually, in our earlier show. Uh, have you got the cards from what we were I making? I have. Yeah, show? I've got a few bits here. It's nice. Or how about something like this? Or what about <laughs> that? Or how about, I've just found this. Oh, yeah. Just found that one there. Very, very pretty. So it just gives you an idea. There's so course, many different techniques yeah. that you can do. All you need is your stamp and some inspiration. Now is the time to invest in exquisite quality, super versatile. You're going to love them. Build up your stash at an incredible price. I just want to reiterate that if you go for a pick and mix, you're paying in the club it's £55.69, yeah. but if you were to pay the regular retail price for the three bundles, it would come to £215.88. <laughs> so let's think about this. £215.88. That means you are saving, as part of that pick and mix, £167.09. Yes, and your please. first, I know, <laughs> your first flexi buy is eighteen fifty six as well. So it is phenomenal value. If you maybe seen these before and you missed out, why not get them at this price? Uh, do take advantage, build up your stash. When are you back? Now? Well, my friends, I will definitely be back by the end of the month. But don't worry, my friends. On the horizon is the next chapter from Amala. Ooh, so Amala coming up, and I'm sure Stamps by me and Tony uh, will be on your screens very shortly as well, very soon. Thank you so much. Oh, you're Carly. more than Absolute welcome. Pleasure. Thank you, uh, Artisans, for joining me today. Do make sure to check out. You can keep shopping uh, while we still got stocks. And make sure to follow Carly and Tony and Stamps by me on social media as well. Carly, thank you. You're more than welcome. Fun. Now, I'm going to be joining your flamingo buddy. Oh, uh, my next. flamingo amigo. Uh, that is our lovely <laughs> Sarah, so don't go anywhere. It is the Craft Cotton Co. Uh, with Sarah Payne's British uh, Waterways One Day Special. Really busy for that.